before I do this. Does this look like chatting? To you? Yes. Game sound too quiet. This stream's too fucking bland. Add salt and pepper to it. Heroes of Might and Magic 3 complete chat. Back when I was a child, all right, I used to buy soldiers in town and not even understand how I was unlocking them. <clears throat> because I was a fucking idiot. I was a dumbass. I was like a four-year-old fucking moron. Okay? So now when we go in, let's see if 23-year-old me, I think I'm 23. Uh, I'm 23, I'm 23. I'm definitely 23. I'm not 22 anymore, I'm definitely 23. I'm 23. Yes. Now let's see if 23-year-old me can, uh, can comprehend what the fuck is happening in this game. New game. Single scenario. We're not doing campaign. That'd be fucking ridiculous. A single scenario of this game is just fine, and we're gonna random map it. We're not doing a real scenario. Now. Now. Human or computer players? I don't want to do eight because I don't en exactly enjoy being drowned by a thousand guys all at once, so I think four for starters is pretty good and see if we wipe and die. Yeah? But we are gonna do an extra large map with Underworld. Or should we? Underworld is fucking scary. Here's the thing, Underworld is like end game fuckery. I did it with Underworld for all my other games, but I'll tell you what, going into the caves and running into a throng of hellhounds is not fun. Going down into the cave and seeing that the thing waiting at the gate so that you can leave the cave doorway being a throng of, like, the worst monster imaginable, not fun. We're gonna do it. We'll do it. Computer-only players, uh, zero. Human or computer players, four. No teams. Water content, normal. Monster strength, normal. Yes. Advanced options, chat. We can either be the castle, which is boring, Rampart, which is what I was playing last night while I was doing my main campaign that I was like doing like practice and learn how to play the game again, which has a lot of good money things, or we can skip to the bullshit. Shall we? Let's just skip to the bullshit. Just for the start. Just uh, let's. All these factions are great and all, all these towns in Acropolis Dungeon. We skip, uh, we skip this one. Uh, but this one right here is good. We skip that one completely. That one doesn't exist. And it's the reason you don't play on random. But this one exists and the rest of them are all cool too. It's just that like one of them is, is pretty, pretty stank. Ah, uh, yes, another Necro player. Come on, Chad, it's about, it's about the nostalgia, and the nostalgia is all about wondering how you're winning as a two-year-old kid, and you realize it's because you have 80,000 skeletons, and nothing matters. Yes. All right. Shall we? We begin with a random warrior, and a random starting bonus. Come! I am... Fent! The silly vampire. A level one necromancer. Who knows basic necromancy. And has a specialty called animate dead, which makes him the dumbest guy ever built in the entire game, chat. Let me explain to you how this is going to work in game. Let me explain to you what Thant is and how stupid this is, all right? He also started with the pendant of free will, which is excellent. All right, chat. So, whenever enemies die in a fight against Than, 10% of them are gonna be brought back as skeletons. This can be upgraded to 30%. So 30% of all enemies killed on the battlefield will be brought back as my normal tier skeletons. Every time without any other requirements needing to be made, which can lead to my skeleton army 
being up there in the literal tens of thousands by endgame. <clears throat> and these guys will be able to kill everything in the game if we don't fuck it up. Now, to add more on to that, we can cast Animate Dead on the battlefield. We have a spell. Hang on. We have a spell called Animate Dead, which reanimates any destroyed undead units in the selected group by restoring a fixed number of hit points to the target. Which means early game, we can even res our boys completely back to full. If we lose 25 of these guys, we have 26 right now. If we lost 25, we'd be able to instantly res them on our turn for all of our mana, which will only get more mana. Necros are too OP. Dude, you gotta play Necros at least once in this game. Now let's take a look at our town. Black Quarter. Necropolis. It sucks in here, actually. This is pretty lame. Uh... Man, this place is bumping. <laughs> well, let's, let's take a look at the tavern. What do we got in here? We got Nagash. Another... His... Oh, his specialty is having 350 gold. <laughs> I think that's, I think that's per turn. Pretty sure. <clears throat> and then we have Stig, the witch. I mean, if you you think I'm a fool if I'm not gonna take only necromancers and be fucking absolutely like bonkers overpowered. But uh, we're not gonna get another hero just yet. Because I like putting it off until the second that it's objectively too late. Hang on. Do I, is the game volume pretty good right now? Or do I need to turn it down? Is the music okay? It's mostly music in this game. It's okay? Good. Cool. Epic. Alright. Bit loud? Ah, I'll just turn it down very slightly. Okay. Well, chat, we need to get started on our house before we start building it, before we start exploring. Every single round of the game, we can build one new thing. We're gonna buy Town Hall first, which is gonna enable us to per, which is basically going to let us get a thousand gold per turn, which is. You just wanna get your, you wanna get your Town Hall leveled up as quickly as possible for the sick cash. The sick cash flow, which lets you knee jerk purchase ridiculous amounts of units later whenever someone shows up at your house. We got pathetic economy. We got bad economy. So we're going to pay some money on out, out right now to level up our city hall. We won't be able to level up again until we get Mage Guild level 1, Marketplace, and Blacksmith. Which I'll explain when we can actually purchase them. So for now, I'm going to buy uh, 12 more of these guys. I don't really need it, but it's nice to have more considering we can actually res them all if they die anyways. So let's go. Outwards. Into the... Marletto Tower. The tower borders our, t our town. And by simply touching it, we gain plus one defense skill for literally forever. Little loud. I, I turned it down. I'll turn it down here. There. I don't, I don't even know if that's just placebo or not. I actually didn't hear any change there. Well, chat. All we're doing right now this early in the game is getting incredibly lucky and getting literally artifacts inside of boxes, which is pretty rad. Also, simultaneously, we're just gonna be collecting random shit in the distance until until we've gained power and levels. So we just got the Glyph of Gallantry from a box. Still too loud. Oh, I mean, chat, you literally lie half the time and you wonder why I don't listen to you. Um, because you've decided it's a bit to lie about audio, so <laughs> it doesn't get changed anymore. Let me take a look at that Glyph of Gallantry that I just got. The Glyph of Gallantry increases your morale by one. We want morale. If we don't, if we have low morale in the game, our enemies, well, our guys will skip their turns. But fortunately, we are undead, and that means our guys actually are not affected by morale. They are my spawns. They don't care about morale. But if we had any living beings, uh, they would not like. They would not like this. They do not like being in an army with the undead. So basically, we're stuck with undead boys unless such time arrives as we want to switch it. Like, we want to get new guys. At which point, we'll want morale. 
that don't have morale. That's because they aren't paid. Now I am going to fight these sprites because lots of sprites means few sprites. That means like like probably like 20 of these little bastards and these guys are pathetic. And that means free that means free fucking skeletons for my army. So we're going to kill them and we're going to go to the treasure chest here, but we are not going to touch the Griffin Conservatory there cuz they will fucking kill me. Okay. So that's our turn. And now it is day 2. What I don't do I wanted to click on the thing. It's fine. We still have enough movement. They come. Sprites. Attack two, defense two, one to three damage, health three, pathetic weaklings. Essentially, we're just gonna let our skeletons do all the work. I don't even wanna send my other guys to them because my other guys basic, basically this is how I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna send the skeletons up, let them get wailed on. Hopefully the sprites will be dumb enough to attack the skeletons. And then when the skeletons are low on health, I'll just revive all, literally all of them. So we're just gonna move the skeletons up and keep the zombies and wraiths back and just let the skeletons take like two damage a pop and then just sort of let them kill all these guys. I don't want them attacking. They're basically permanent cannon fodder. And at this level, we can revive literally all of the losses and they should instantly kill these things. Yeah. So we're just gonna let this, we're gonna let the skeleton handle this. And uh, actually might as well revive him now. Yeah, we'll use, we'll use it now. We want to have as many skeletons as possible, and considering we're not really going to be... We don't need spell points right now. Spell points regenerate every turn. A little... A, a few of them every week. Well, turn. So... We have to be careful with them eventually when we have more spells, but that's the only spell we have right now, so we can sort of do whatever the fuck we want with it. And since we killed 25 fairies, we got one skeleton out of it. We really need to level our necromancy, but we need to level up more to do that. But we can use this treasure chest after scouring the area, you fall upon hidden treasure caches. You may take the gold or distribute it to the peasants for experience, which experience us early in the game experience. We need as much experience as possible so we can level up and get our wacky stuff. And before Tomato gets wiped by hell monsters, fuck the hell monsters, dude, I hate them. We've gone to a sage's home and he says to us, in my younger days, I'd have done this myself, but I need your help. A friend of mine recently had a family heirloom stolen and wants to find it. The problem is that it looks exactly like the Cape of Conjuring. Please bring me any item that fits the description, even if the artifact is not the family heirloom. I will reward you for your efforts. Which means he actually just wants the Cape of Conjuring. Which we're never finding. Oh, that's a good fucking pull. Lots of archers protecting three treasure chests. If it wasn't archers, I would go for them immediately, but I think I want to wait for the week to roll over so I have more troops before I fuck with archers. So we're going to keep exploring and just activating anything in this area, capturing any, like, points that give us resources and stuff and just living our lives. But remember, every turn, you want to make sure you go back to your city because you can, you can buy something new every turn. And we want to immediately just keep rushing City Hall this early. We don't even care about new enemies or new characters yet. We just want, we just want this. We want whatever lets us get increased defenses. We want our Citadel and City Hall leveled with our money for now. The archers will slap me. Oh, I'm aware the, the archers will fucking slap me pretty bad. I don't want to fuck with the archers until I have more skeletons. Even then, don't really want to fuck with them yet. But what I do want to fuck with is that mage guild, baby. More heroes means more gold. Yeah, I'll be buying new heroes in a second, actually. It is about time. And we do want another necromancer for my army. Yeah, no. We've purchased another boy named Nagash. And he is just going to keep exploring as well. To collect more shit. He's, tra he's very light on his feet, so we can get a lot of XP and money. Nagash is already leveled up. And he has two options before him. After gaining plus one defense skill. He can either get advanced necromancy or basic wisdom. Naturally, you're going to get advanced necromancy. 
which gives you 20% of all the deaths of a level uh, made into skeletons. Excellent. And we're going to keep exploring. Basically, we just want to capture everything in this area as quickly as possible. The School of Magic. The tingle of magic fills the air of this school of mystical arts. An acolyte offers to sign you up for the next class for 1,000 gold. They're just letting necromancers come into, like, college. My guy just goes to college for a week. You will have your choice of increasing your knowledge or learning, better fo learning to better focus your powers. Knowledge determines how many spell points your hero may have. Under normal circumstances, a hero is limited to 10 spell points per level of knowledge. Yeah, we take knowledge immediately because we want as many casts during a fight of necromancy as possible. 1,000 bucks. Well, I mean, we make 1,000 bucks per turn now. We're not spending a bunch of it right now. So let's capture that ore pit, which will give us ore every day. And keep traveling. Until we find the enemy faction who will instantly wipe us both, wipe both of my heroes with endgame warriors. Pretty much inevitable. Thant has now leveled up to level two with two options, advanced mysticism, which allows you to, he to regenerate three spell points per day, which is what we're going to take. I'm not even gonna fucking bother even like explaining. This one just increases your hero's damage with magic by 5%. We're gonna take advanced mysticism. That's actually like ridiculous. We need that for our work. And we got a seer's hut here. I've spent my life buying, selling, and collecting artifacts, but lately I've been spending so much money acquiring new pieces I could hardly turn a profit. I think I might be able to start mass producing artifacts, but I've got to have one first to copy. If you could bring me the quiet eye of the dragon, I will reward your efforts. I don't think I ever bring him quiet eye of the dragon, because that's like a pretty good ring last i recall yeah we don't we don't give him that i don't think lots of goblins and there's the still eye of the dragon i thought we just got really lucky but no that's the still eye of the dragon that goblin's protecting i could probably beat him if i had the full army of both of my guys so i might just exchange uh the army for one of these guys and then send him back up at the end of the week to get more guys from town either way we have to buy our stuff from town now we got more stuff we gotta get, and now uh, it's worth starting to invest in some new soldier. Necromancy. Ah, here it is. Yes, this is what I wanted. Build Necromancy Amplifier. The Necromancy Amplifier increases the Necromancy skill of all heroes you control with the Necromancy skill by 10%. Chat, now? Now our boy here, who already has advanced Necromancy, is gonna be resing people for 30% of all losses on the battlefield. Yes. <laughs> now. All right. We're not going to do this goblin yet because I want to make sure I have enough guys that I'm not going to lose to goblins. That'd be pretty embarrassing. So we're going to run up here and we're actually going to have Thant here exchange his forces with with uh, Nagash. So I'm just going to have him give most of his guys to me because I'm going to have Thant run back up after this and get more soldiers anyways from town because we're about to have uh, them replenish but I want to make sure that we can actually beat this guy and get this artifact so and that's just gonna keep exploring no one's gonna attack him this early in the game hopefully so we shouldn't need more than one guy to do that he's just gonna keep grabbing stuff until like day six and he's gonna run back we just want supplies and supplies there is wood everywhere which is good keep exploring a little bit and let's see if we can beat normal tier goblins yeah it's about time to see if we're tough or not. Shall we chat? Who's tougher? Me with like a hundred, well, like 70 men or a lot, just a lot of goblins. Uh. They come. I mean, I'm gonna do the same thing as last time for the most part. And that's send goblins, send my skeletons out because they are the most expendable skeletons and these guys though i don't really want to lose my fast boys but yeah the skeletons can instantly kill a pack of these things right now losing about three a turn we'll make a profit on this fight at the end of all this as long as they keep attacking skeletons first oh yes 
Yes, Chad, we are going to gain quite a profit on this one. I'm not going to use any of my other guys. We lost 11? We gained 12. That's right. <laughs> That's right. And so the nightmare begins. That's right, we break even, we gain one. And now we gain the treasure. Still Eye of the Dragon. Worn on the finger, this item increases your luck and morale by one. Yes. Shall we? I need I need Thant to get some treasure that gives him Oh fuck, I didn't buy the thing. God damn it. I forgot to I forgot to buy a new thing for the for the castle. We need to get the marketplace and the blacksmith. So that we can uh so we can get the next tier of our money castle thing. Also next week I wanna purchase a troop item so I can buy so when everything replenishes on day seven, well after day seven, uh we'll be able to get a different kind of troop. But for now Thant continues to explore and get wood. And hope that we Ooh! Pendant of free will. Don't we already have that? Wait, didn't... Wait a minute. What the fuck? They mass produce these things. <laughs> we already have that. Son of a bitch. Whatever, now, now, uh, now Nagash can have that too. Treasure. Man, this would have been great for Thant to get this much XP this early. But hey, whatever. That's level three. Advanced intelligence. Increase the hero's normal maximum spell points by 50%. We're gonna need to start pursuing magic on this guy because he doesn't have resurrection like uh, Thant does in fights, unfortunately. I don't think he has anything like that. He does have some stuff though. He has magic arrow, he has curse. He has slow, he has stone skin. He's got some stuff. But Thant's the one that we want getting spell points and spell regen right now. Let's go to the mystical garden and talk with the leprechaun. He gives us five gems. Let's go pick up this uh, pendant. I just keep exploring for now. Lots of genies over there. We're not doing that. <clears throat> There's another glyph of gallantry and the dragon wing tabard behind those genies. We're not going to worry about that yet. We got a spell scroll for shield. Okay, and this is a gatekeeping situation. We can't go any farther this way without clearing out the gnolls here. We should be able to take gnolls pretty comfortably. Yeah, gnolls ain't nothing. We can take gnolls. Especially with me using magic. Which I have. A lot of them. A lot of them is as few as you can get, chat, for the record. Lot is like lot is the easiest form to do. So. I'm actually gonna have these two handle these 13 here. Yeah, a lot is basically as few as you can get. What you don't wanna see is throng or poor this early. But these few, yeah, we can take that. I'm actually gonna magic arrow this fruit. Just to try to make sure that we actually kill it without losing any troops down here. We did not? Yeah, it basically chat how necromancy is gonna work is skeletons do literally everything and the rest of my guys cry. <clears throat> but that's okay. We lost five skeletons, we lost one zombie. But we gained 11 skeletons. Because of our magical powers. Shall we continue our work? Do you see? Chat. Lots of beholders. We don't really want to fuck with beholders. I didn't see them when I moved down there. All right, City Hall. We just need to buy a marketplace. We can level up our income per week again. We're not going to buy another troop type yet. Because, uh, because we're skeleton boys right now. And I'm waiting to be punished by uh, the NPCs that come in any second now and destroy my entire base and kill me on week two, which is about to happen. They'll come right out of this subterranean gate, chat. So get excited. I'm seeing something here. Oh, skeleton warriors. Okay. All right, we want to start heading back on this guy now. That needs to go buy more troops. The horde of hobgoblins. We don't want to fight the horde yet. We want to look for we want to look for pathetic weaklings that we can easily gain some numbers from. All right, we should be able to get the city hall now, which is going to make us two thousand dollars a day. 
Don't you see how the rampant happens? And we can buy 18 skeletons, which we are going to buy. And we're just going to leave them in town for now because Dant's going to come pick them up so that he can... Actually, he's not going to come pick them up yet. We don't need them yet. We're going to keep picking up whatever is on the ground. And just continue to explore, gain gold, star axis, which gives us plus one spell power. There's a school of war there and a redboard observatory. We're going to go here, which unlocks basically the whole fucking circle around us. Oh, yes. Now we have options. Quiet Eye of the Dragon. Wait, again? Wait, no, that's the one they want. That's the one the quest wants. What's it being protected by? A horde of hobgoblins? And the only way to get there is to get to a pack of dendroid soldiers. Ugh. That screams I'm being gatekept, actually. That we, uh... A pack of dendroid soldiers is... Not, not good. At my level. A pack isn't exactly a ton, though. It's just like dendroid soldiers are sort of assholes. They're slow. If we get some ranged boys, we can t we can deal with it. Or if we just spam magic arrow. Look at this though. Red dragon flame tongue protected by. Ooh, never mind. <laughs> Ooh, sorry, chat. We're not going there. Not for a while. We need diplomacy. That's right, chat. If we get diplomacy, we can start really doing some dumbass shit. We just trick them all into joining us. We need to buy the castle? Yes. More power. Might be worth getting a third hero if I'm not sending uh, Thant back for a while. A garden of revelation for plus one knowledge. There's another redwood. Man, we got a lot of work. We got a lot of map coverage. All right, there's no one living near us, which is good. Which means whoever's going to come and attack us is... Probably either down one of these roads, down where I am right now, or they're going to come out of the gate, which is going to suck. I hate when enemies, when fucking people come out of these gates, and unfortunately we have a lot of gates. So, uh, actually that one's not connected to us, technically. But we'll have to keep an eye on that. Got some kennels, which let us buy hellhounds. We're going to buy hellhounds. <laughs> We are going to make a point of purchasing hellhounds. And we're going to double back for now and just keep collecting stuff. Go by the School of War. A battle-scarred instructor of the School of War grunts as you walk past. For a fee of 1,000 gold, he can teach you your choice of new attack or defense spells. Defense. Uh, unfortunately, while attack sounds good, uh, we want defense. It, it boosts every unit that we have uh, protection, like resistance to damage. In combat, skeletons are very slow. So no matter how many as we have, if they can't get to the enemies before they get killed by archers, what's the point of having them, you know? So, we get defense. They need their calcium to grow big and strong. And now, let's get a capital, which boosts our income per week, well, per day, to 4,000 gold. Now we can start fast-tracking other upgrades, because now we have a billion fucking bucks coming in, chat. Lots of skeleton warriors. It's probably worth either sending our boy back or buying a new hero. Who's at, who's at the tavern right now? We have an angry polar bear named Draken. Or we can get a death knight. Who also has basic necromancy. Hmm. We're not sending Thant back for a while. So it's probably worth getting the death knight. I'm gonna get him. so that we can find a way to kill our character like an idiot. Good news is, pretty much any place that says not visited means I can regain the bonuses of them. So every time one of my heroes leaves or gets spawned in from here, they can immediately get plus one defense from that tower. We're also going to immediately get plus one knowledge as well. Yes. All right. One more of your heroes may not, may be able to move still. All right, happy now. Look at our army. It's pathetic. There's barely any of them. Thant really needs a good level up here. Yes! All right, we got advanced necromancy on Thant. I want everyone with advanced necromancy so when we get lots of units, we can start getting stupid and looking for throngs and stuff. We want advanced necromancy in all of our guys. Only thing better than that is diplomacy for us. Grab the sulfur. A 
throng of trogs. There we go, chat. When we get more stupid abilities, chat, we're gonna be going after this throng of trogs. That's our first one. Trogs we can take, but we're gonna need more guys for them. We cannot take them yet. So we're gonna keep going down. Lots of skeleton warriors. We might be able to take lots of skeleton warriors. But for now, we just want basically anything I can pick up off the ground. We're not really in a rush. Bird of Perception. This figurine increases your eagle eye skill by 5%. We don't have eagle eye, so, um, actually, I'm not really... Chat, what it... Can someone explain to me what exactly eagle eye is? It's an ability, right? Like, I, I don't just naturally have it, correct? Pretty sure that's like a hunter thing. Pretty sure it's an ability someone gets. It's a skill? Okay, a shit skill. Worst skill in the game. Alright, so this is a trade scenario. We trade that. We get rid of it. I think I'm gonna take on... Actually, first I'm gonna swing over this learning stone. Man, we got... Alright. We already got advanced necromancy on all of our guys now. So I just need to start killing people. Uh... What I'm gonna do... Since Dant is still miles away, I'm actually gonna run Tamika back up. Because, actually, I'm going to have her go here first. Because I'm going to go pick up the other skeletons when the week rolls over. In two more days. And I'm going to start killing all the hordes in this area with Tamika. It's time to start getting ridiculous. And that means it's time to start buying stuff. We need to get Skeleton Transformer. Which lets us transform all creatures we receive into skeletons should we choose. Chat. And next week... Next week, we buy Unearthed Graves, which increases skeleton production by week per six. Per week by, per week by six. And now you see why necromancers are dumb. Yes, the skeletons. Unfortunately, Thant can't do anything because he currently only has one skeleton boy on his team. So, yeah, it's time for Thant to uh, swing by some of the other stuff in the area and then go home. Yeah, 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 yeah. A horde of master gremlins. We could take them, probably. We could probably take a horde of master gremlins. Unfortunately, they're ranged. So we might get fucked. We might lose all... The trick is picking our fights sort of carefully early game because we don't want to lose a bunch of skeletons. Start heading back up. We'll probably either transfer all of our troops over to this guy. We'll see. But either way, this next week is very important, so. Uh, unearthed graves. Yes. Start running them back. By the time the week rolls over, they'll be back, they can pick up their troops, and we can start wiping people out. We need to spread our skeletons somewhat evenly. Can you divide your units? Yes, you can divide it to have multiple skeleton packs. Like, you can easily do that. Just like this. Uh, though I don't usually do that unless there's a good reason for it like you need to have multiple like you have a bunch of archers and you want to be able to hit multiple guys at once for reduced damage that's why you do that if you want multiple guys to be able to hit come back north if this guy makes it all the way back before uh, before the week rolls we're gonna give the skeletons to him for now Lots of goblins. Ooh, we can take goblins. Yo, uh, actually... 40 skeletons here. Ah, it's just few enough that I'm not confident we could very, like... I I'm not confident we'd come out with a net positive from that. Alright, we'll wait there. Fant! God, you suck. Oh, wait, you can go to this garden again. Nice, Fant. Oh, we can squeeze through that. Alright, let's go through the mountains then. Then we'll just keep exploring for now. Get him XP that way. Oh no. Oh, they're not that tough. It's just Alligar. All right, and he's actually not near us. There's a mountain here. He can't pa he can't pass this, so he's not that bad. He can probably get through this way, which means he'll kill Than if we send Than up. But Than's going up. That money's ours up there. All right. Wow, this character is very quick. 
Alright. The week's about to roll over, so we are going to spend our money on purchasing... Yuck. No one buys Walking Dead. We'll buy Whites. Whites are okay. We want to basically get more troops right now because it means that we're going to get... We get an instant package of them right now, and then when the week rolls over, we're going to get an additional one. Alright, the week rolls. Collect everything in this clearing. Lots of money. We're sitting on a lot of money. Magic Shrine of Incantation. Teach, uh, teaches us haste? No, we have... Actually, I think we have haste. I'm not entirely sure. I think we learn haste because we do that. Someone can correct me if I'm wrong. I'm still not very... This is not a game I'm super proficient in. There it is. Yeah, we get haste. Okay. High level haste on skellies is the best. Oh, I, oh, I know. We're gonna have to send everyone up here now. This is like a this is like a, a, a rite of passage everyone's gonna have to take because of that. I never went here to get the XP obelisk. Huh? Okay. Well, let's um. Let's do. Let's go ahead and split some of my troops here. So that these two can actually do stuff. So I'm going to give... She has like 40. I'm going to give her the walking... I'm going to give her those. I'm going to take some of the... Uh, she's not going to get any more troops. Tamika. Tamika. Uh, she's going to split now. And start... Heading on up there. I think I want everyone to have haste. So I think everyone needs to go pick that up. Is that a dead end up there beyond that? Yeah. Oh, that's killable. Go kill those sprites. How many is that? Can't see him. Damn it. I don't want to send her up there until I know how many sprites there actually are. We can probably kill the gnolls. Where was those goblins? Lots of hobgoblins. Let's go kill those hobgoblins. She should be able to take a lot of hobgoblins. I hope. That is going to be a short game because our fucking second character instantly dies like an idiot. Whatever. We've got a billion fucking troops to hire with our good guy. Yeah, baby. All right. Things are going to be different now. Things are going to be different now. Power has shifted in our favor. Now then. We need a resource silo. Let's boost our wooden ore to plus one per day. Buy that. Yes. Can't wait until Tomato gets the cloak and the infinite power lich supply. There's all sorts of wacky synergies in this game, especially if you're a necromancer, dude. Hmm, chat, you think I can take this guy? You think I can take a lot of archers? How much, what spells do I have? I think it comes down to spells. We have magic arrow. We do not have... We do not have, uh... I, with wraiths, we should be okay. We have 21 wraiths and hellhounds, which have a, ha a faster speed than the wraiths. They should be able to close the gap pretty quickly. Hellhounds have a lot of fucking health. It's not a horde, it's just lots of them. I'm gonna go for it. That's a lot of treasure. Close the gap. Okay, they're actually, yeah, that's pretty bad. They did a lot of damage to those hounds. Magic arrow. Mm. Just get to them, dude. Oh, no, we're fine. <laughs> they don't do much damage to the skeletons. At least we made it into melee. Those hellhounds, we can buy more. They're not They're not that important to me. I'd rather lose them than skeletons, to be honest, this early. So. What the hell? Did that... Guy just decide to die? Whatever. Kill him. Finish him off. Add to their numbers. We lost 12. Expert necromancy right now. Give it to me. 30%. Chat, you know what that means? You know what that means? In reality, 40% of all the enemy's losses will become skeletons. Eight skeletons added to my army. Give me more XP. 
Give me more XP. Expert intelligence. We need to start leveling our mage tower now. Now that we have expert intelligence. Give me money. No more, no more XP on him. Okay. Tamika, uh, you can take hobgoblins. This should be a piece of fucking cake. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Skeletons, baby. You gotta watch out. We're gonna let the skeletons handle this. Get us some fucking... Get us some gains. Bonk. <laughs> yes! What do we got for magic? Magic arrow. Curse. Increases the selected enemy unit. Dam causes the selected enemy unit to inflict minimum damage in combat. That's fucked up. Dispel removes the spell effects from friendly creatures. Slow. Stone skin. Eh, it's magic arrow. Then. They, he makes the Roblox oof sound, doesn't he? When he gets hit, those little hop goblins. Whatever, they're dead. We lost five, so you know what that means. We gain six, baby! You gotta watch out! You gotta be careful around necromancers! All right, that you gotta find out what your purpose is, because at this point, I'm not really sure what you're doing, my team. We got too many heroes. Specialty Walking Dead. Everyone has a specialty. Hang on, what's everyone's specialty in my team right now? I forgot to check. Oh yeah, your specialty is gold per day. What's yours again? Your specialty is Animate Dead, which is so good. If we see another guy with Animate Dead, we need to get that. And your specialty was Black Knights, which is also. Increase the attack and defense skills of any Black Knights or Dread Knights for each level attained after 6th level. Holy hell. <laughs> That's pretty good. Those are very good fucking... Those are very good. Alright, well, uh, let's buy our new building. We need to get the graveyard to uh, buy much else. Many of the, like, helpful new characters. Because we want to get... We want to get Liches and Black Knights, and both of those require... I was getting the prerequisite places now. So we're just going to start getting all the old stuff. God, this game is so much fucking fun. Like, I could genuinely play it forever. It was a lot of fun. It was nice to realize... Wait a minute, who am I on? Oh, I'm on Thant. All right, Thant, I guess I'll go back and pick up the troops whenever... He gets there, and then we can kill these goblins and let Thant get some kills on, like, the guys around us. While these two explore. Yes, we've leveled up to level 6 already as Nagash. Basic Scouting allows you to see one square further into the Shroud. Or Basic Scholar allows heroes to teach each other first and second level spells, effectively training spells between spellbooks. Yes. Uh, I, chat, does that mean that if I go up to Thant right now, he can give me his haste knowledge? Is that how this works? Is it both ways? Because I want haste on my guys, and I also don't want to have to run everyone up there. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wing it on that. Alright. Alright, so plus one spell power, gain. A lot of beholders. There's a part of me that wants to wing it and try to kill those beholders, but I'm not sure I can do it. I'm going to go get some hellhounds first at the hellhound store, and then we're going to try to kill those beholders. I might be able to take beholders. They're ranged archer-type characters. All right. Hey, man. Oh, here we go. Nagash, who has studied magic extensively, learns haste and protection from fire from Thant. And teaches protection from air, curse to spell, magic arrow, and stone skin to Thant. There it is, baby. All right. Now, uh, Thant, this is gonna seem like a, like I'm being mean to you, but uh, I am gonna be. Actually, I'm not. Actually, I am. Take the trash artifact, motherfucker. Get the hell out of my face. I'm Nagash, the necromancer. Actually. In hindsight, we'd probably want to be having the gash on the bench for a little bit and get Thant leveled. Hey, bud. Give me, uh... Actually, you hang on to that hellhound, buddy. And, uh... 
Give me the ring. Yeah. And uh, give me the gallantry back. You take back the uh, that one. I'm going to have him pick up, guys. Because he doesn't have resurrection. He doesn't have res. This guy can actually kill... Guy. We can punch... We can punch up with uh, Thant because he's got he's got a res spell. Uh, not everyone does, so we sort of want to use Thant, I think. Buy some Herald Hounds. Lots of Lizard Warriors protecting the boots of speed. Chat, how fancy are Lizard Warriors? I've never seen one before. You can feel free to answer for me. How fancy are they? Are they like what tier of like town are they from? Tier two. Okay, they're ranged tier two. All right, I have hell, I have hellhounds again. We should be able to take these guys. There's a lot of them. Oh, they, they don't do much damage. Okay, we're fine. Magic arrow them. Magic arrow these ones. Yeah, just start hitting them with magic arrow. I mean, then again, it's really just gonna come down to do the skeletons get there before we wipe. Like idiots. Well, Hellhounds made it, and that's good. Don't do they do so little damage. They're just buying us time to close the actual troops over. Please don't kill my right! Skeletons, you gotta get there now! I have to use stone skin on my skeletons before this gets bad. Alright. The whites. They're here. Ow! The skeletons might be able to win this dude by just sheer numbers. Fuck you! Please. Oh, they were gonna die. It's over. It's not looking good for us, chat. It's really not. I gotta aim for the larger packs. Oh, zombies are so bad. It's uh, looking like a retreat for me. Not great. Hey, but that means because we retreated, we can just buy her back here. And she won't just fucking die forever or leave. You want to retreat if you have to choose. Oh. We needed haste, dude. That's why I need to get... That's why I need to meet her up with uh, Nagash now. Which I guess is good timing. We really need haste on those skeletons, man. <laughs> okay. Well, you can't win them all, dude. And that, hey, that could have gone a lot worse. The Great Nagash would have won? Well, he also has double the troops she has, so yeah, he probably would have won. I don't really like vampires. I want liches. Right now. Because we need... We need those. I don't think I get interest on this character, so we can just buy him right away. We want power liches. All right, Thant. It's your time. Start bullying enemies in this area and gaining their numbers. Start with these goblins. Yes. The goblins, awed by your power, begin to scatter. Do you wish to pursue and engage them? Always. Always. I cast haste. Begin the massacre. Look at them. We take more turns in them because we're so fast. Haste chat. We lost three. We got. We lost two skeletons right there. We gained nine. Now you begin to see how this works. A horde of imps. Yes. <laughs> Come to me. Come to me. Cover of darkness covers your city with a permanent shroud to all other players. We haven't seen any other guys yet, so I'm not very compelled to do that, but I am going to get power liches, motherfucker. It's time. <laughs> yes! Upgrade these ones, too, while we're at it. Power liches! All right. Nagash, can you please swing back there? Okay. While that's happening, Tamika, what the fuck am I going to do with you? You're not very... There's not really much you can do right now until we get either another town or, uh, you know, just hang out. It's like, I don't know, go to, like, the water mills. Are there any water wheels around? There's no one up there. She can get us some money, I guess, from doing that. 
She used to be so strong, and then she wasn't, dude. I guess she could be a troop fairy, that's right. Ooh, that's a lot of imps, baby. That's what I'm looking for. We're looking for numbers like this, chat. We're looking for numbers like this. How many spell points do I have? Oh, plenty. All right. Haste them. Yes! Yes! Come! Oh, baby! It begins! With haste, the skeletons can just close the gap so quick and they do so much damage because there's so many of them, chat. There's just gonna be so many as long as we don't fuck up. Alright, where's the next pack of guys we can take? Yeah. <laughs> Let's go get the wolf riders over here. Those guys are good. You take these guys. Go to this. Go up here. Hit, uh, hit the hit the mystical garden too. God, necromancy, dude. Okay, we want to buy the estate now before the week rolls. Okay. Hang on, who do we have in the tavern right now? I always want to keep checking the tavern just in case we see someone with res in combat because that's so good for like for making the uh, like the skeleton horde getting a guy with res means that we can just bring half of them back if it gets fucked early game which is nice as shit and works on any undead forces actually so pretty good we're gonna have Nagash just sit here for a little bit longer oh no that's someone to the south of me that's someone actually accessible to the south of me by those hordes of goblins all right so that's where the most the people will probably end up coming from wolf riders uh we do 75 to 126 damage they have 10 health there's a chance we one shot these guys we did not but we might as well have they didn't do enough damage to hurt me but now they're gonna oh not enough baby activate haste get away from my friends Nope. <laughs> yes! Yes! Nine more to my army! Nine more! Give me XP. Expert mysticism regenerate four spell points per day so I can cast haste literally almost every turn. Yep. Lots of orc chieftains are next. Do you see, chat? Do you see my power? And it won't change the fact that I'm gonna wipe. Hall of Darkness, there we go. Now, now she can start getting some gains. Cause she specializes in Black Knight. So once we get her level six, she'll start actually gaining some decent value. But for now, she's just gonna explore this place up here and try to get kills. Well, try to get Activations on, I don't know, whatever. All right, chieftains, 25 of them. How much health do these guys have? 20. Yeah, this is gonna be a fight this time. These guys are gonna be a fight. Oh, they throw. Okay, dick. Okay, dick. Dick? <laughs> oh, what did you think? Little fucking asshole, we lost 15. So it begins. <laughs> yes. It is about time we ascend to the final the final tier of our power. I suppose we'll go to the horde of imps next. Kill them too. Jack. And horde of skeleton warriors. I wish I could tell what that magic thought shrine was for. Either way, let's send Tamika back. The week has rolled, so we can buy our troops again. Everything has replenished. Before we buy them, let's see if we can get any upgrades. Whoa, 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 there. Is that a fucking specialty meteor shower, necromancer, I see? 
That's a level four spell. Uh, huh. To move Nagash out of here to do it, though. Get out of the fucking way. And you? God, you're being benched, Tamika, so bad right now. Oh my god, we don't have enough troops to handle three fucking, well, four fucking people. And I'll tell you what, there's no fucking way I am not taking a meteor shower specialty warrior. Buy him. Give him power liches. Let's get this guy training. Give him everything he needs to begin his work. Need levels on him. Power liches. Whatever he needs, give it to him. Yes. And Nagash? You just hang out for another week. <laughs> and you... You start getting swole, bud. Vamp's forgotten. Dude, I do not like the vampires in this game. They feel sort of, like, trash to me. I don't know. I should have probably taken spell power there, but... I haven't played the vampire. I haven't used them enough, but like their first tier version was so trash that I, I, I just didn't even want to go near it. Uh, let's get since we have a mage now. Let's start getting mage guild level two. Let's start getting the mage guild leveled up. Vampires are one of the best units. They resurrect themselves. Vamps are overpowered. Well, then I guess Nagash can buy those. 12. Actually, I'll hold off on buying them till next turn and I'll get the upgrade version. I'll take your word for it. I don't know much about this game at the end of the day. Other than LOL, necromants are fun. Hee <laughs> hee. Give me your souls, motherfuckers. Come on. Look at how slow these guys are. We're doing a bait and switch over here. I'm gonna have to... Yes. Perish. I'm not even gonna send the white over. We lost seven. We gain 18. And so the nightmare continues. Yes, chat. Yes, the power. Okay. At the same time, this guy should be able to take a horde of gnolls. Odd in your power, they begin to scatter. Do you wish to pursue and engage them? Absolutely. I would also like to cast Meteor Shower on them just to get an idea of how much... Actually, I guess I can check from the thing. It's going to do 75 points of damage. I need more magic power now. But Meteor Shower is an AoE, so it's going to be very good later. But we're going to shell these guys with the power liches for starters, so... Yoink. Yeah, let's let them come to us. These guys are slow. A little bit closer now, a little bit closer now. Yep, they're all dead. Might be able to do this without actually having to take any damage on my main. Ah, no, a skeleton will probably have to get into a clash here. Actually, let's just send the zombies in. Those guys are the worst enemy, like, guys in the whole game. We do 120, we do like 150 or so damage. Possibly enough to kill all these guys in one. Yep, okay, cool. 14 more skeletons. That was a puzzle map piece. Uh, basically, eventually, we'll be able to dig up a piece of super treasure somewhere on the map if we get all the puzzle pieces, but... We're gonna talk to the Tree of Knowledge instead. Upon your approach, the tree opens its eyes in delight. Ah, an adventurer. I will be happy to teach you a little of what I have learned over the ages for a mere 2,000 gold. Just bury it around my roots. Okay, give me advanced necromancy, motherfucker. <laughs> yes. I'm gonna go kill these hobgoblins. We should be able to take a horde of hobgoblins on that guy. Man, Tamika, I'm not sure what I want to do with you yet. Oh, well, let's send you to that tower. That's a good start. Matter of fact, he's never even been to that tower. Probably be worth it. 
I wish Nagash wasn't on the fucking bench right now. I forgot to buy a house again. God damn it. Fine, I'll just settle for the Dragon Vault. It's time. It's time. Okay. So, anywhere else I can, like, murder people? Horde of Skeleton Warriors there. I guess, I guess I can do that. Ske Hor Skeleton Warriors aren't exactly very much of an upgrade. To be honest. They've got like a little bit more attack skill by default, but like the rest of their stat, they're not that incredible. That's why I don't usually get them. They move faster, but like, <laughs> what does that matter? You know what I'm saying? Hey, I'll see you later. Hey, hey, I'll see you later, all right? <laughs> give me your, give me your souls! 22! More! More! More power! All right, let's lose this guy to a fucking, actually, we can do beholders instead. Let's do the beholder. All right, uh, gang. Let's just go ahead and, um, Cast curse on these. Yeah. These guys are assholes, but we should be able to take them. They kill five skeletons a pop. I would like to I would like to murder these things. They have a lot of health, is the thing. But the melee combat skills are terrible. So good news is Good news is we're we're gonna win. <laughs> Good news is we've got a lot more chances in melee. I'm not going to spend meteor shower on these guys since it wouldn't even do anything really. But yeah, the Black Knight's very good. Yeah, that's right. Run. And die. We gained advanced wisdom, which gives us level 4 spells. Or we can get basic earth magic, which allows you to cast earth spells at uh, advanced wisdom. Yeah. Forsaken place. Much to your dismay, the Forsaken Palace is guarded by a few devils. You wish to fight the guards. I'm good. Thanks, so. though. Let's, um, let's not do that, no. Uh, let's go fight this lots of skeleton soldiers. How about that? How about we do that one? Uh, okay. Wait, where's, where is she? Go hit that. Excellent. Also, go over there. Those are scary units. I don't want to fight anything with devil in the name. Alright, Thant is now level 6. Which could give him basic sp scholar too. I don't think I want that for him. We're going to give him basic wisdom. And we just learned forgetfulness. Which is a spell that allows me... Half of the selected enemy unit forgets to use its ranged attack. <laughs> God. That's actually fucked up for my first skeleton voice chat. That's pretty fucked. That's that's like BM at this point. That's pretty bad. <laughs> I imagine but like now I don't have to be afraid of being skeleton boys against them. Oh, that's fucked. Alright. Skeleton warriors awed in the power of your force begin to scatter. Engage them, chase them. Murder them. Murder them, kill them. Uh, shell them with power liches. Yes. We're gonna let the uh, zombies handle this one. They shouldn't be able to reach anything but the zombies from this range. Oh, really? Oh, you, li you uppity little shits. Okay. Give me your souls! And your sulfur. That was a sulfur mine we just captured. We continue to travel. Uh, we are gonna purchase the upgraded estate. People tell me it's good. I'll take their word for it. Let's see what an upgraded vampire lord can do. Now that we're out of money. We need another fucking town, dude. We gotta go, like, we gotta go capture some. We gotta take Thant down, dude, and, like, get some. Lots of G. 
horde of infernal oh yeah the trog swarm hmm, i wonder if we're, we're ready for infernal trogs but to be unlocking a stockpile of psych like a cyclops stockpile which isn't very good let's go fight those let's go over here there's things over here we never discovered including the depths so we're gonna do that we can't take cyclops what we can do is the school of war Wizard warriors. We lost to those assholes last time. I'm not inclined to go fight them again. I'm not I'm not very interested in fighting them again just yet and losing my people a second time. So let's just let's just stay the course and fight fight guys that are scared of us for now. For now. Upgrade the Hall of Darkness. Obtain Dread Knights. Yes. Man, Nagash has been taking a pretty smooth vacation this week, dude. All right, horde of pixies. Get ready to die. Here it comes. You guys are acting real big shit running at me like that. I respect that. Perish. <laughs> oh, really? You killed eight of my boys. <laughs> so I will take ten in return. All right, this is dumb. Uh, I'm actually gonna save for this. If I lose my my team because I go down here and it's being gate kept by like black dragons, all right, I'm not gonna take that. Those are my many saves. This is my new one. I'm not gonna take that. Uh, you can get, all right, we're good. You can get fucking scammed here and get like being gate kept by end game enemies at these subterranean gates. And you genuinely cannot tell until you go down there, because you can't leave again once you go down. Until you've killed what's at the gate. Press spacebar? Oh. Well, now I know. I just thought I couldn't leave. Oh no. Oh. Haste! Haste! Kill! Kill! Faden! Give me your souls! 18, baby. What do we got down here? Welcome to the sk- Oh, that's a throng. I don't think I'm ready for a throng, chat. I, uh, I don't think I'm ready for throngs. As much as I want a throng, I still don't think we're ready for a throng. I can't take a lot of skeleton warriors, though. Get them. And by get them, I mean, like, hang out right here. Yeah, we're gonna treat this. We're gonna let the power liches do their thing on this one, I think, Chet. We didn't sort of just let the power liches hang out. Actually, six health. Yeah, these guys are dead. Bonk. Yeah, goodbye. <laughs> so what stopped that thing? Oh, wait. Hang on. Okay. More power! For my armies. Ooh, ballistas. Ooh, baby. These guys sell, uh, this is a fucking war machine building. So we can buy ballistas here. We can buy a first aid tent, which heals troops. And we can buy ammo carts, which I don't need because all my guys are magic. I think. Yeah, let's buy this. And this. Medusa stores. I don't think we go in there. Pretty sure that gets us in a fight. Horde of pit fiends. Pack of what the fuck is this area? I mean, I want to get that. I want to get that fucking sword and Pandora's box. That's like crazy amounts of loot down there, but it's all very difficult enemies. Mage guild level three. Let's upgrade the tomb of souls. Wait, where you at? Hit that. Nice. Gang, I think we... As much as I like this guy... Gang, I think we bench him. And basically make him a haste uh, slave. Where he basically just does nothing but exchange haste for new heroes. And sit at the main base making me money. Because um, he has no meaningful specialties that make me want to use him later in the game. Whereas Tamika is going to have... You know, the the fucking Dread Knight buff. 
at level six. I think we want to get her to level six. He was weak. He is sort of weak. In hindsight, he's pretty weak. Because, like, his bonuses don't really make me think I really want to use him. Grab this money. Grab this spell scroll. A lot of master gremlins. More like doomed. More like get the fuck out of here. Come here! All right, that was a big mistake. You made a big mistake. I like how I gain just enough magic power every turn. Well, every, like, yeah, turn lap that I can literally use haste at the beginning of every round. Die. Give me his skeletons. All right. More XP. In this case, yes. So I think we were about to, yeah, level up. Advanced wisdom. Now we can learn fourth level spells. Good. All right, man. Can we take a horde of master gremlins and get through the rest of this area of the map? I think with power liches, yes. Oh yeah, they're scared of us. <laughs> yeah, hordes like 60 guys usually or so. Get them, my children. This guy doesn't have haste. What he does have is meteor shower, which does 125 points of damage. I don't really want to use it yet. God, that's so much damage. The power liches, baby. Who's hitting our skeletons? What does that matter? They're gonna be the new ones, dude. They're gonna be the new ones. Get out of here. Get the hell out of here. Twelve. More skeleton. Ooh, more. Lots of master gremlins. Come here. Come here. Yeah. Just auto combat, dude. This is a nothing fight. <laughs> yes. Yes! More. Scholar, as you ride into a clearing, you notice a university scholar resting his horse. He agrees to teach you some of what he knows before setting off. Isn't that nice of him? All right. Well, uh, I'm going to go ahead and purchase Mage Guild Level 3. Man, dude, we've got a lot of spell options now. Because we got Mage Guild level 3, we get Death Ripple. Sends a wave of death across the battlefield, which damages all non-undead targets. This is going to be great for our, uh, our boy here, whenever he gets back to base. Or more specifically, uh, for Nagash, who's about to purchase all the troops from this area and walk them down to him in about two minutes. In about two minutes, we're going to have him ferry troops, because that's his new job. He's a troop ferry. He's just like a taxi. He's being benched. Actually, we'll probably give him to Tamika. White population doubles. Not bad. That's a lot of whites right there. Wow, you guys are awfully confident. They didn't actually run. I thought they'd run. All right. Hey, all right. All right. Here. Come here. Oh, you drained my spell points. Fine. We'll see about that. What the fuck? I haven't heard that fucking notification in so long because hosts don't exist anymore, Joe. Why'd you do that? Joe, what is this? You're not even... I don't even think hosts are a thing you can possibly activate on stream anymore. How'd you do that? Thanks, Joe. For the host. I'm playing Heroes of Might and Magic 3. Perish! I'm playing Necromancers, which means basically I'm playing... Uh, the most bullshit fucking build in the- Give me your, give me all of them back! Give my skeletons back! Yeah, motherfucker! Yeah! Thanks, Joe. Hope you had a, uh, hope you had a good stream, man. Am I ready for a throng of something? No. I'm definitely not. I don't think I'm ready for a throng. I don't think I'm ready. I think a throng would be terrible. That would be game-ending right now. But let's get Mage level, Mage Guild level 4 code, which gives us chain fucking lightning. And, oh yeah. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. Now we can start buying replacement troops for everyone. Eh, get the get the rates for sure. They've got bonus numbers today. We're gonna need to take a couple days to buy all these, but uh, we can ferry some of them to Tamika right now, so she can get back to work. Yeah. Actually, we'll wait one more day to do that. As Iceland, Iceland, it, it's time. Get back to work. We need to find out. Oh, a horde of monks. We don't fuck with that. But I will fuck with a pack of unicorns. I will tango with the unicorns. Though I'm not going to gain many souls from this. Unicorns just have a lot of health, but against the skeleton, they should be okay. I'm just going to kite everyone away. There we go. Yeah, they're dying. We got them. We just got to keep them away from us. Now, our power liches are going to... Oh, they are killing a lot of our fucking skeletons, though. But our dread knights have a lot of health. We'll be okay. Oh, that's my tent. I forgot about the fact that I have to protect my back line more now. Fuck you. The tent, dude. I just want to keep him away from the power liches. That's actually our main damage on this character. All right. I'm glad they're going after the skeletons. I'd still prefer losing skeletons over losing any other troop. Considering they are, well, that and zombies. All right. We gotta loop all the way around to get this guy. Zombies are basically just big fucking like the metal walls, it's very hard to, they have a lot of, like, they can just take a lot of damage, is all. But they also do basically fucking nothing in a fight, and are almost worthless beyond that. But yeah, that was not great for us, but it did level us up. Expert wisdom. Ooh. Level five spells. I mean, it's time to send this boy back, as well. It's time to go back and collect some stuff. Yeah. Stuff ain't looking good for these two people on our team, because it's mainly... We got two guys that are very good and two guys that are sort of filling in... There's no space for them. We need another city for them to really be able to thrive, is the thing. I think I need, like, to get another... I need to get farther south and find a city where they can live and be happy, because right now there's nothing for them in this place. Do I have the guts to take? I do not. But I am getting a lot of fucking treasure down now. All right. I'm just gonna get the cover of darkness, dude. Yeah, now we got a fucking shroud of fog of war covering us and all of our actions. Bone dragons, give them here. Okay. Uh, we're gonna exchange these. We're gonna, like, ride down here and exchange these with him. Uh, right now, we're also gonna teach him our haste spell. We're gonna have Tamika hang out in base. So we're gonna have him meet up, give us some troops, because we just lost a bunch. It's a long fucking trip up north, chat. Oh, we are definite. Oh, boy. I oh, just killed the throng like it was nothing. Oh, that guy. That's gun. That's gunner. Got a pack of Medusas, a few Minotaurs, some. Oh, that's some bullshit is what that is. Just keep him the hell away from me. I'm going to keep looting. Because I'm greedy. And while that's happening, let's hurry up and get our, uh, get our, our, our exchanged troops. Yes, look at that. Give me haste. And also, 
give me a fucking like hypnotizing thing and all the dragons and the vampires and hang on those are those are old school wraiths i don't want those i do want these though and i want this because i'm about to buy more uh, hellhounds at the hellhound store all right you head back up i'm gonna give these to tamika so they can keep leveling up and uh yeah you go buy hellhounds lots of whites we can take them more skeletons look at the dragons dude imagine though pasted dragons that's all i'm gonna say i'm not actually gonna do it but imagine it just think about if it was a thing you know we're gonna let the skeletons handle most of this and the power lich yeah because they'll they should be able to clear that out pretty quick get rid of that Oh, all right. Never mind. Oh, there we go. All right. Nice. Let's see how these vampires do. They do 118 to 190 damage. And apparently, people are saying that they self-heal. So maybe large numbers of them will be good. Yes. Six more skeletons to my army. All right. Can upgrade I only have a couple more things to upgrade. Let's upgrade the uh, uh these both suck. I don't really like getting the upgraded skeletons because they're not that good and they take up a slot where normal skeletons could be filling, you know what I'm saying? Where normal tier skeletons that get resurrected by necromancy could be. They heal when they attack, but not off of undead. Okay. I'm just gonna upgrade the graveyard. So if I had to have a choice between these two zombies, I would take the one with even more health and speed, I guess, for tanking. But I'm never gonna buy them. We're basically just gonna look for, we need a town. We need a new town to live in, chat. We gotta get one of our boys lucky finding like a, oh God. Oh God! They come. They come for our homeland. Enemies everywhere? No, it's just this guy. He may not even come in here, but if he does, we're gonna wanna be ready. And that means we need more power liches. <laughs> we need another week or so of power liches. We might need to bring this guy up. Yeah, we're gonna need to bring him up. He's got all of our troops. I'm not gonna send I'm not gonna send Thant up. Thant needs to keep steamrolling loot and skeletons. So he's not doing anything like that. He needs more he needs like a thousand he needs like two thousand skeletons before I'm gonna be happy with him. Understand? He needs more power. Go! Uh, go to this one. Damn it! Really? Wow, that was sort of dickish. The way they sort of predicted my bullshit, I think. Alright, fine. I'm gonna go forward one. Yeah, now that, we're, now, now that we're all on the same page. Twenty-eight skeletons to my army! Yeah, it's basically more efficient for me right now to not send up my other guy in an attempt to stop those assholes from being in my zone. Fortunately, there's not much for them to capture up there. Just kill. Uh, so I'm, I can sort of ignore them for now. But they will eventually be coming around. And when they do, I gotta be ready. So we just buy our time. We just bide our time for now, chat. Unfortunately, we don't have enough. We don't have another town, so we don't have enough troops. To oh my fucking god! They're bringing everyone. Oh, they're bailing out. All right. We're not going to. We're not going to have him completely leave yet. But we're going to have him back up again down this way. At least now we know where they're gonna be coming from. Actually, I should probably. That's probably a pathway over there. I should check that. 
Imp Crucible. Would you like to recruit imps? Sure. Also, give me more defense skill. Also, that's another kennel for more hellhounds. I never got to that alchemist. I skipped the alchemist lab. Whatever, we'll come back to it. 15 imps. And they're just coming into like... God, they're everywhere. The tans, dude. Garden of Revelation. Lots of familiars. I don't remember how tough familiars are as a thing, but I'm not a pansy. Oh, they're scared of me. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're not. They're nothing. Tier one little shits. Yeah, look at mine though. <laughs> yeah. Haste. Kill them. All right. I like how I'm getting double whatever I lose. Chest. After scouring the area, you fall upon a hidden chest containing the ancient artifact, the breastplate of petrified wood. All right. What's it do for me? Worn on the torso, this item increases your power skill by one. I gotta give that to Iceland. That'll boost his fucking meteor shower even more. Okay, we're just gonna hoard money for now. I don't need to buy any of these guys until people start getting near us. All right, Aslan. Let's, uh, let's kill these archers for one. What the? Yeah, fight them. Get them. Get them. Just like auto-fight. This should be a nothing. Actually, no, don't auto-fight. Haste the dragon. Perish. Yes. Yeah, those archers are fucked. I need more. I need more bone dragons. That's the thing. They're not. They're not. They need. You need like ten dragons for it to get ridiculous. Unfortunately, like they do damage and they have a lot of health, but we need more of them. We need like a thousand of them. Expert necromancy. Give it to me. <laughs> yes. Shield of the Yawning Dead. That sounds like something that would help me, a necromancer, become more powerful. I think I will go get that. They just all come in to like touch. Oh, they're chasing me. How tough do you think that one is? <laughs> all right, we can take him. Good news is that is a end. That's like a fucking. That is that is the same level as Tamika tier weakness right there, but without the power liches. So I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna ignore him for now and just keep looting everything before he gets it. The horde of skeletons. Soon they will be mine. We'll let them come to us. Is what I would say if I didn't gain as much haste as I spent every fucking turn. Get them. I actually don't really want the. Yeah, they're gonna come for the skeleton. Yes. All right, another another excellent display. 21 more skeletons to my army, and we can buy some hellhounds while we're here, and some wood. This is going ex this is going swimming. I really can't get through there, huh? Okay, so this is all just for this section. Whatever. We'll go pick up the rest of the troops from the week that rolls over right now with all the money that we have for this guy, and then we're gonna start doing some ridiculous power plays. And then get raided by uh, the enemy while we're distracted by doing ridiculous power plays because we're gonna start going after throngs, chat. Once we have another wave and we, kept, we pick up all the power liches from Tamika, we're gonna be able to do some stupid crap. Look at these pathetic throngs. Or XP, give it to me. Basic Eagle Eye! Give me archery, which boosts the damage done by ranged creatures by 10%. I love Eagle Eye! I actually don't know much about it other than the fact that chat told me it stinks and that I should never use it. Alright, let's start buying all the troops that I want. Dread Knights. Another, another skeleton zombie thing. And then next turn, when it rolls over, we will run these all down to Iceland. 
Oh god. Oh no, that's a different spot. Okay. Hit this on our way out. And keep going up. Lots of harpies. Good, good, good. God, this fucking game is so much fun. Ooh, I could upgrade the Dragon Vault. But that would seriously push back my ability to purchase troops this turn. So I'm just gonna buy the troops that I want instead. Because I can afford to do that. I will start worrying about that once we've given all these to our boy. I don't want actually upgraded skeletons. I just want normies. Because the normies are the ones that... The normies are the ones I like. Yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna grab any more of the vampires. Let's run these out to him. Hey. Is this campaign? No, this is just a scenario. How the hell would you play campaign? Give me all your stuff. Give them here. All of them. Uh, you can keep the zombies though. Uh you can also take the whites. Actually, you can take the uh shitty hellhounds that I'm never gonna use. Yes. Now we have a fucking army. Whale chat, back south. Let's go. We need to test our might, all right? Now, I am going to say before I do this, because I'm also partially aware of the fact there is a chance this ends up being 6,000 men, and I actually reload because it's ridiculous. So I'm just gonna, this is gonna be a check. I wanna know how, I, I vaguely remember throngs not being that ridiculous, but they might still be really ridiculous, okay? I don't wanna lose all my troops to a throng. If they're that ridiculous. Because there's a chance they're ridiculous. They come. I'm just keeping all my guys back so the skeletons can do this. Like they always do. Yes. More. Expert wisdom. Allows you to learn 5th level spells or basic pathfinding. I'm going to take basic pathfinding on this guy. Actually. For now. There's another kennel. What's up with the amount of dogs? Down with it, I guess. Alright, let's wing it. Let's see how fucked this is. I don't even actually- I need to save this something that isn't complete gibberish. Or I'm never gonna be able to tell what I fucking need. Uh, throng test. Oh, they're good. They're, we're good. Okay, we're good. This isn't billions. I've run into halfling hordes, which are literally 800 men in a throng. So I wasn't sure what to expect here. <laughs> I've actually run into fucking ridiculous numbers in throngs before. Like, and I was a skeleton guy, and I was like, there's no fucking way I'm gonna lose. And then I, I lost because of that. Yes! Yes! How much damage do we do? Enough to kill almost all of them with this. Yes! 36 skeletons are popped to the throngs! Lots of wolf riders come! Battle them! Auto resolve, kill them all! Slay them! No, oh, the vampires did heal. Look at that, back to 20. That's pretty good. I'm glad they're. Go yeah, that's pretty good, actually. Alright. Another 18. What we got here? An air elemental conflux. I've never... I'll take him. Uh, I would need to ditch someone. But I would just ditch these fucking shitty whites. We are going to have a problem with, uh... Morale on these boys. The current morale... Oh, they oh wait, never mind. They don't have morale. Nice. Usually guys are fucking, like, whining all the time because we have a couple of undead and stuff like that. It gets ridiculous. Is that Darren? And that's Darren. Yeah, I think that's weak-ass Darren. I think we'll be okay. It's just Darren. All right, Sears Hut. Pendant of Holiness. A throng of mummies. Protecting Pendant of Death. That sounds like something I want. How, how, uh, how tough is a mummy? If we if we had to take a guess, how tough are mummies in this game? Not, not tough. Not tough enough. They're slow. 
They're not bad. I'll take those chances. That's a, they're very tough, chat. That's a lot of health on the... That's a lot of health. We're gonna have to use... We might lose a lot of guys on this one. I'm gonna chance it, though. I'm gonna give it... I'm gonna give it a solid chance. If the skeletons get to them, we should be okay. Are these ranged, though? Do they have a ranged move? No, they're melee. Okay. Then we can sort of game them off of the skeletons and plan on that. I don't know why I always run my guys up instead of down when the fucking power liches are down here. They're slow but hit hard. I could kite them with the fucking dragons for a while. I don't know how fast they move. They we'll have to see how fast they move right now, I guess. Honestly, I want both of them coming up here, so I'm gonna move this. I'm gonna move the dragons up for this turn. I don't want them going after power lich. Let's see. Okay, that's actually not that bad. And good news is they're all going for the same side. We just set that up. So we can haste the skeletons now and get them to basically face tank this and see how that works for us. We're going to keep everyone else back and just let the skeletons sort of do their, like, get aggro, I guess, for now. Let's see. We do 200 to 600 damage around. Yeah, we kill about 15 a pop. And they kill about 18 of us a pop. So we need to start getting in there. We need to get rid of the highest stacked ones possible. Okay, yeah, we'll be, we will win. It's just not a very comfortable win. It's not a very comfortable win. But we'll be okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're, we're Yeah, we got this. I don't really want my dragons to hit them, though, with how much... Ah, fuck it. Yeah, we, we... We... We should make most of our losses back, too. Well, this Black Knight can just hang out. For now. Yeah, we got it. We lost a lot of skeletons, though. But I don't think we lost many of anything else. Yeah, we just lost 81 skeletons. That's the sort of losses we want to see, is just skeletons. Advanced archery increases damage done by ranged attack creatures by 25%. Or increases the hero's normal maximum spell points by 25%. That's a hard fucking pick. That's actually, that's tough. I think I, think, I, think I want the power lich buff, though. That buff power lich is a lot. I think I take archery. We get two. <laughs> yeah, it was worth it, chat. <laughs> it was officially worth it. Let's take 50% extra melee range damage on our guys. How about that? And let's get the Pendant of Death. Wearing this item renders your units immune to the Destroy Undead spell. Probably worth it if I'm a Necromancer character to have that, I guess. No, do not dismiss that hero. That's not what I meant to hit. Probably worth having that for my necromancers. <laughs> if I'm being realistic. How are we doing on money? God, I really need to get another town. We just need to find one. We haven't found one yet. All right, let's chase after Darren. I forgot to grab that gold. Loins of Legion. Yeah, kill everyone. Kill them all. We need to make our money back. We lost a lot of fucking troops in that fight. We just bunch up here. Oh, chat. That's an awful lot of damage for only 21 liches. We need more power. This is gonna get spicy. Yeah, it's pretty good. Give me the loins. Yes. Oh, someone's real close to us up here. They just dipped in and out of visibility, but we can't get over there, so we're fine. Loins of Legion. This item, when equipped by a hero in a town, increases the growth of your third level units in that town by four per week. Third level would be the wraiths. Oh, I need to bring that all the way back to make it worth doing. 
Let's go kill these guys. He's ranged? Yeah, they're ranged. Uh, alright. Go get them. Get them. God, I love this fucking game. I, it's aged so well, too. It, it, honestly, because of how they did the visuals for this game, it's still very appealing to me. I don't know. It never, it doesn't feel old to me. Really, it doesn't. All right. We lost some air elementals, but we gained skeletons. We're gonna kill these whites as well. Who's gonna auto resolve? Them? There's a lot of nostalgic art, and it's also art that aged, I think, pretty well when it's HD upscaled. I mean, it's not, like, incredible, but it doesn't look, like, ugly, I don't think. Mainly because it's not 3D, it's all sprites. Basic learning increases the hero's gained X H uh, XP by 5%. I guess we take that over Eagle Eye. Imp cash, attack them. This is gonna be a good amount of souls, chat. We are gonna do it like this. Move everyone up. Get, get the top wave. I want the other ones to try to stack and we can just kill them all with a fucking, with one nice skeleton slam. Actually, how much damage can we do? Oh, we could probably just one shot all these guys actually. They're sort of nothing. Oh, this is sad. <laughs> I forgot these are, these are imps. They're not really, oh, well, it's like, 40 free skeletons now there, so that's good. Now we're sitting on 250 of them. Uh, lots of whites. Hello? This is pretty close to my house. Dace the Overlord. Hey, Dace. <laughs> get, uh, get ready to die. Dace, I've been following you for a while. I know that your town's up here, by the way. Oh my god! Who's that? Oh my god! I didn't get an eyeball of him. I didn't see him properly. That's scary. Well, I want to hit these towers. For me, these are buffs for me. Hey, Dace. <laughs> hey, Dace! This is sort of sad. Don't run. He's gonna try to run, and I won't get a proper kill on him. This is, I'm gonna get killed. I mean, karma is gonna. Yeah, he got out. Coward! Need more knowledge. He's a coward, Jed! Uh, dragonfly hive. A throng of imps. Freebies, chat. That's like a billion souls added to the. Add it to my pile, my army! Power liches! Kill them. Yes. Power liches! Shoot them again. Fucking so many. Give me this ring. What is it? Ring of life. This item increases the health of all your units by one. Oh, chat. That's pretty, uh, that's pretty good. Lots of iron golems. We're not gonna fuck with those, though. We are gonna fuck with this horde of hobgoblins, though. I love how with necromancy, it's the only time that you're really encouraged to just fucking fight. Like, no one gets to run. You kill them all. You get them. You just go get them. Well, we lost one vampire. Because I was too hasty, but... Horde of centaurs. Kill them, too. Kill them all. Just kill them all. Give me billions of troops. We're finally... Chat, the, the ball's starting to roll, dude. It's gonna start getting fucked up soon. These skeletons hit for one to three a pop, which means now... They'll be hitting for, like, the same... Like, more than the power lich is doing melee. Yeah, they'll hit for... I almost want to see it, dude. At this point, I almost just want to see it. Because these guys are stupid, so they'll go after the fucking... They'll go after the skeletons anyways. 703 damage. They hit for 0.4k to 1.2k. 
advanced learning. Uh, take intellect at this point. At this point. Warren. All right, so ten players been here. I still need another fucking down, dude. This is bad. We'll upgrade the dragon vault now for sure. Not much. Else. There's not much the other two people can do because we. Ah! 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 Help! Help! It's Darren. It's got. It's Darren's big brother. We knew this would happen eventually. We did know it was going to happen eventually. We knew. Everyone needs to get to the skeletons or you're going to die. That's a lot. The Minotaurs are bad news. Uh, those are a bad scene. Those are Minotaur kings. Yeah, it's looking like a retreat for old Thant. Yeah, we got a retreat. We lose. We gotta go. Help. We are so dead. Those guys are tough. Good news is, because we retreated once again, we can just re-summon Thant like it's nothing. Welcome back, Thant. <laughs> let's uh, let's try to avoid that next time. <laughs> Let's try to, uh, let's try to keep that from happening, uh, next run. We'll circle back, we'll get them next time. There are no troglodytes to recruit here. Someone's coming through here and they're recruiting all the trogs, chat. Someone's been here recently. I need more power liches, that's what I fucking need. Or I need the fucking thing that gives me, mul like, many power liches. I need that fucking amulet, dude. What if we, dude, if we find it though, holy shit, it's game over. I'm thinking about it. If we find like the super thing that gives us like infinite power liches. The odds of it are so slim. But imagine. Okay, week's about to roll. We can just re-equip that right away and send him back out when the week rolls over. We got enough money to do it. Just more of hurts because we lost all of our skeletons. It takes, it takes a long time to build up skeletons. It's a lot of work, dude. Uh, I don't really like doing the Griffin Conservatories. Uh, is that Monolith Two-Way? Let's do it. We might be able to get a town here if we bully someone. Chat, what I'm thinking is that if we go up to the surface, we might find- If we follow these roads, we might find a town, and if we capture it, then we can make more money! Oh boy. Was that who I think it is? Is that- that- surely that's not who I- Oh no, it's just this- it's just this asshole. We can take that. That's not who I thought it was. If it was Gunner, I was gonna have to start panicking, because we can't get- We can't get this guy back in time to help with that. Right, we're busy like bullying master gremlins and crap like that, you know? Like we don't really Oh, I guess these guys are ranged. I should start closing. Wait a minute. Oh, I don't have it on this guy. I don't have the confuse spell. Ah well, we're gonna power lich him anyways. Yep. Give me your souls. Hey, at least this guy's gonna have a good setup. Where it doesn't matter what they do to the rest of my base, Aislinn is gonna be sitting on a good amount of fucking skeletons by the end of all this. He's at he's at the point where throngs aren't really that scary. They do a lot of damage. Like fuck it, I don't even want to think about how much damage this skeleton actually can do now. I don't even want to know. I don't want to check to see. I want to be surprised. All right, keep moving. Let's buy some replacement troops for our boys. Buy normies. Don't buy. Don't buy the special ones. You guys didn't earn those. Come on. Let's just buy a bunch of normies. We'll fill them up with everything that we can purchase, and we'll wait another couple turns and like build a couple more. We do need him because this asshole is gonna try to fuck with me. I think so. Yeah, we're gonna need the garrison. 
pumped up. We'll, we'll be ready by the time they get here. Good news is I don't need my money for anything else anymore. Horn of Whites. Kill them. Kill them all. Power Lich. If you would. Yes. Yes. What's more? They survived. Okay, well. Yeah, still 1.4k or so. And only getting stronger. Who's this? I can't see his fucking name. Chet? This could be bad. I can't tell if that's fucking Gunner or not. That There's no way that's fucking Gunner. He got the shoes! Yeah, that's right! That guy's dead. That guy just fucked up big time running by me. Come back here right now. I don't see anything that freaks me out, honestly. At the same time, I would say that we're probably so evenly matched that I'm going to end up walking away with the worse, like, overall because of it than he would because I it takes me so long to build up my skeletons. So I'm probably just going to let him walk, considering we're nowhere near my base. He isn't even close to your power level. True, but like, I'm trying to build an absurd amount of skeletons. And I'm so far away from my home that if I lose any of these guys, I'm gonna be fucked. I have to make it a long, I have to travel very far to get back home. So I'm trying to be sort of careful with my other troops right now. And those are the ones that I'd be losing if I started a real fight right now. Kill them and grow your ranks. I'm growing my- keep in mind, I'm growing my ranks of default skeletons. I mean, talk to the scholar. Which aren't exactly very impressive. And not exactly worth the massive trade-off if I lose. I'm looking for a town. Be a brave boy. You guys just want to see me fucking eat shit and then get angry. See, that idiot's just doing whatever he wants. I'll let him, for now. Let him wear himself thin, and then when he comes crying back home to mommy, I'll kill him. Chet? We really also have, we do have to bring our guy back home because, um, we just unlocked Dimension Door. Wait a minute. Oh my god. Yo, can you cast that from here, bud? I'm not sure if he can cast it from here. How do I cast Dimension Door from here? I'm not sure he's actually good enough to do it. Nah, we don't have advanced. We don't have super wisdom yet. I think Dimension Door is a level four, level five spell. He's gonna need the next tier. Does anyone have that? No. God damn it. Yeah, this guy needs to get another couple levels. That's fine. We're about to send him out anyways. Just filling up on a couple more troops, and then we're gonna do it. Mirth? I'm not sure if it's worth continuing to go this way, considering that guy looted it. Wait, no. These NPCs need to fucking make up their mind what they're doing, because, like, that was an unlooted pile of gold. They just ignored. They just left it there. I think you can only trade up the third level spells. I wasn't thinking on the trade thing, chat. I was thinking on the, um, in the case of, like, I can bring troops to my main guy, Aislinn, right now. And be a fucking asshole. Uh, by basically ferrying troops with Dimension Door to my frontliner that's way out here. And is gonna struggle to get back home for a while. I forgot this is an archer. Paste him. To be fair, the AI doesn't need any gold, it cheats. Oh, I'm keenly aware the AI in this game cheats pretty hard. Which is why I don't feel guilty about playing Necromancer Asshole. Ow! That was fucked up. I saw that, that damage. Alright. Kill him, finish him. We 
lost 55 skeletons, which means we get 40 back. Which, honestly, it's pretty good. It's just auto combat. This, this is, this is gonna be like, this is a comedy act. Fighting pixies, dude. <laughs> this is like a routine. Advanced intelligence increases the hero's normal maximum spell points by 50 percent. Ah, uh, more money. We're at the money phase where we take money instead. We're just gonna fight everything that we see and continue to grow our ridiculous amount of stuff. Look at how many spell points we have. How much damage does Meteor Shower do now? 200. More. 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 Literally just swatting mosquitoes. It's the necromancer way. Chat, we're just waiting to get our power lich buff. We're on a hunt for true treasure. 24 more skeletons. Spell scroll. I don't even think we have anything left to upgrade in the game right now. Yeah, we've got a finished fucking town. We just need to find another one. Which I'm, I'm honestly shocked it's taken me so long. That's a ghost dragon. Well, good news is, uh, Fant's ready to head out and keep trying to level. No. We don't need another ghost dragon. We'll be fine with one. God, look at all these fucking tans, dude. Look at all these tans. All right, so there's nowhere I can go up here, right? I'm actually gonna take this subterranean gate, I think. Rather than the one to the south. Wait. That's the one I took, right? Which one? Which gate did I take? I took this one. Okay, I want to go to the bottom one, not the top one. Eh, change of plans. We're going to the bottom one. Grab that. Forgetfulness and more resources. More blood! Just charge them! Getting antsy. Those wraiths are actually holding up pretty well. Eh. Lost two vampires. Honestly, still not super jazzed about them. I think I need more of them than I have to really be able to have them be a good uh, outcome for me. Uh, how do you tell towns apart from other locations? The big. Who's that? Oh, he's going back downstairs. Should probably check who that is because currently we're leaving our base completely unprotected. There you go. Oh, he fucked off completely. No, I didn't actually check that subterranean gate. That one there. I'm gonna hope that this doesn't bite me in the ass later, but I am gonna save. With just a save name called Throng. So if I totally eat shit and die by making the worst strategic decision of my life, I can undo it and say that my game crashed. Man, I sure wish one day I could get a graveyard. I mean, a town. A town. Something like that. A new one. Maybe another, maybe another necropolis town would be cool. You know, chat? Oh, this asshole's just capturing all of my shit. The greens, they're coming, dude. They're coming from the north. Oh, and they got a lot of, actually, that one's not that scary. That one's got, actually, that one's not that scary either. That one's actually, wow, these guys are fucking, I'm not very afraid of green so far. Their stuff's sort of bitched here. Graveyard. Do I even care? No, I don't. We'll take the gold, though. Horde protecting some garbage. All right. How full is his team? Full to the brim. We're going to take on that throng, get ourselves some extra guys, get ourselves some skeletons, get some XP, try to get to that level four. Then we can get 
then we can get Dimension Door and become uh, Ascended Gods. Uh, once we get that, chat, once we get Dimension Door, we no longer need to protect our base. Like, literally, it won't matter, because we can just teleport our guys back to the base whenever we fucking want. I do wish I had more Power Liches, though, for this, but we should be fine against these guys. Chain Lightning! Wait, how far is this jump? The next adjacent unit. Nah, it needs to be closer. I didn't realize we had teleport. I can do anything yet. I'm just gonna move everyone to this side. Where stuff's more narrow and confusing for the fucking trogs. Kill their special. Oh, perfect. Even better. We have res on this guy, on these guys, so we can just send the zombies in and just fucking really clown on them. Alright. Alright, they're dead. Yeah, we're gonna jam on these boys something fierce right about now. We're gonna let them, we're gonna let them keep chasing us though for another minute. Before we, before we engage. Let them get whittled down before we sweep in from behind and take them out. Wow, they're not, they're sort of idiots, huh? What is this? Wait, what is this? Why aren't they? What is this? Why is that one going so slow? Are they scared? What is this? Whatever. They're not... Hey. <laughs> well... We lost two zombies, but we gained 64 skeletons. <laughs> I've never been down here. A horde of gogs. I can take dogs. Gogs are assholes, but they're not that bad. They're a ranged class more than they're a fucking melee class, so we're just gonna close on them. I'm going to haste uh, the wraith. Get him over there faster. You have a decent amount of health, though. Know? But we should be okay. Get on this one. And you finish off this one, yes. Vampire! Yeah, that's pretty much it. Once we get into melee, they're a lot less scary. Goodbye, Magog. Expert wisdom. There it is. Now we can learn Dimensional Door. I don't think we have it yet, though. Like, we have to go back to town to learn it, so... That's sort of a bummer, but then again, we can warp back the second we get it. So... Probably worth running up and just getting right away. Actually. Because we can just warp back there once we're done. I highly recommend you upgrading your skeletons. I might do that now. I might do the bulk upgrade when I get back. Oh my god, imagine if we do it now, dude. On this guy with 502. I don't like buying the uh, I don't like buying upgraded skeletons, but I will upgrade. I will actually upgrade them. Uh Why do you always skip the magics? They're not really necessary. <laughs> right now at least. I mean, I'm not struggling for mat like spell points. I've got a ridiculous amount on most of my guys. I'd rather just have the increased powered spells. So far, I haven't been struggling on my spell amount, like the amount of like spell points I can actually cast. I don't see much of a purpose in doing that. You spend less mana and they improve the power of the spell. Yeah, but I'm not using many earth spells, am I? I'm like getting earth ones and like... I'm not using many damaging spells. If I got one for air, maybe, but I'm not... I don't really need them. Really. Besides, it wasn't like I was going to trade that off for not getting, like, Dimensional Door. That'd be foolish. Uh, I want to get this guy. What do I want? Tanking him. I guess these guys are fine. All right. Yeah, we have so much fucking... Man, as it is. Get him! 
my steeds. <laughs> Why did I even, man? Whatever. That's a tower. That's a, maybe that's a. Please, a throng of skeleton warriors. We can take that. Yeah, we might be getting near a fucking town. We're getting close, baby. Yeah, these guys aren't going to be able to fight us, I don't think. Yeah, this is a, this is one of the sad ones. All right. Yeah. One thousand damage. <laughs> Just for more souls. Please. Oh, unclaimed. Mine now! And it's a match, it's a wizard one too, even better. Chat, even better, because that means magi. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't have wanted a different thing. Most of these guys don't suffer from morale penalties. Like the iron golems and shit, so I can just fucking merge them right into my team. Okay. Let's just get rid of the Magi and let these guys walk to us. Yeah. Hold off on that. Hold off on that. Get them. All right. We'll let these guys walk all the way to us. <sighs> Goodbye. It's just so strong just letting the power liches do most of the work, dude. It's pretty fucked. <laughs> Get the fuck out of my face, motherfucker! Expert learning! Chat, we now have another town. It's not much. It's honestly embarrassing. But what it does have is potential. Do you understand? It's got, it's got potential. Oh, shit. Oops. Sorry. It's got potential. Oh no, now the chat's closed. Hang on. One second. Now the chat's closed because I accidentally clicked off the game. It's not a locked window, unfortunately. Okay. Ruined it! This shit's got, this shit's got potential, Jet. All right, that's the magic of the skeletons. Well, this place, okay? First of all, though, we're gonna need to get a town hall because we're gonna start making more money now once we get a tavern going. We're gonna be able to get a town hall. We can start earning more money per week, which is great. All right. At the same time, uh, let's just keep moving. We need to find out what's around us because this is a subterranean town. I really need to get this guy back home for the dimensional door, dude. He's the only one that knows how to use it. More imps for my army. Can I upgrade my skeletons at that map? I bet I could. Maybe. This is auto resolve. It, the goblins kill themselves against my guys. Yeah. 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 More power. We learned mirth again. More skeletons for my army! All right. Uh, parapet. I think that means gargoyles. I don't know. I don't want that. I will go to the mage tower, though. There's a lot of recruit. You can get a lot of troops around here, chat. This is pretty good, actually. All right, good news is that can learn dimensional door now. Which means... We can start getting fucking ridiculous. We can start getting really stupid. I'm pretty sure. So let's start getting let's start getting ridiculous with our army layout cuz we can just fucking go wherever we want now on the map. All right. And that's dimensional door. Also going to buy a bunch more dragons. A bunch more power liches. We're gonna upgrade all my skeletons for a meager sum. And get 146 skeleton warriors. 
we're also gonna get more wraiths and more zom more vampires. Next turn we'll get the the dread knights and then we will be Gucci. All right, town hall. Yes, yes, yes. Wait, more gargoyles here. We're looking for throngs. <laughs> We're looking for hordes of things. Also, I think it's time to level all these guys up to fucking warriors when I get back to town. Magi. I can't fit them, but it's good to have them there. I need diplomacy, dude. I could be have I would I'd be sitting on so many fucking troops if I had diplomacy right now. They'd be begging to join my army. Like that's how it works. Like they see the power of your guys and they just say, "Dang, man, I, 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 I sort of want in." I'm surprised these whites are actually still alive. More horde prison. That might lead to a really good hero. We want that, because we want a guy that can hang out down here and like keep this place safe, because we have no idea what's around it. That might be pretty good. Prison means, prison means like upgraded heroes. Kill him. I wish it counted as like, I wish it just auto instantly resolved so I didn't have to like actually do this. How much damage does my meteor shower do now? 200? No. No, 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 no. We're gonna send the skeletons up and see how strong they've gotten in a second, I think. Yeah. We're gonna see how strong the skeletons are now. After this. Alright, we're gonna haste this boy. So, uh, yeah, these guys do 2.4k maximum. <laughs> and it's only gonna get stupider, baby! Give me more. A new... Oh my god, it's... It's Gretchen! Her specialty is goblins! She's a level one barbarian! With honestly nothing of... Gretchen, can you like, just go pick up treasure? Like around the map, or, or something I guess, cause like... This is honestly not gonna fly. I'm not gonna give her any of my troops either, so don't even bother asking me to. Pack of champions protecting a treasure chest. Richard, go like scout the area. We don't know what's around here. All right, let's uh, pick up the Dread Knights and uh, level up the other town. We wanna get City Hall, so we need Mage Guild level one, Marketplace and Blacksmith, okay? more money that's honestly the only reason we got another town but this guy is now ready to go chat shall we use our immense hang on cancel that we can just chat we can just go wherever we want now we can go and collect souls from anywhere on the whole fucking map where we choose it's fucked up where was some of the really good loot that I wanted? Oh yeah, there's that ring. Protected by a throng of hobgoblins. We can take that real quick. You can choose auto-resolve and options. I know, but it still does the animations. I would really like the red dragon flame tongue sword, but that's a horde of diamond golems, which I don't think I can take. I'm gonna go with that ring. Oh, is it only... Chat, how does this work? Is it only in my like current sector? So do I need to like border that and then teleport it? How does, uh, how does Dimension Door, or does it, like, open a gate and I have to walk through it? It's a radius around you. Okay, so I can only warp the stuff near me. So I have to go to the mountains and I can go over. Okay. That's good. I was, I was almost, I wasn't exactly sure how it worked. I was worried that it was going to let me just jump across the whole map. That's good. I'm definitely not bummed or anything at all. Gods, perish, get him.
Fuck these guys, kill them. They killed my fucking elemental! I don't think I've ever seen him do a thing, so I don't I don't think I'm gonna miss him. Doubles chat. Doubles a hero's normal maximum act spell points or basic sorcery, which increases the damage of my spells by 5%. I think we take expert intelligence in this situation, yes? I'm thinking we take expert intelligence instead of basic sorcery. Although I can't get more tiers of basic sorcery. I can't get better versions of sorcery without getting first sorcery. But I am mostly buffs right now. Let's do the cash. Get him. Get him, my children. Kill them all, murder them. Destroy them. This is, uh, fucked up. Okay. And that's 25 more skeletons to my army. Alright. I'm actually surprised that I've made it this long without even seeing another enemy. But soon, very soon, they'll be coming for me, chat. Very soon. Matter of fact, there's that one over here that was doing... Oh, no, he's not here. Okay. Horde of goblins here. This person's just supposed to be exploring. Pendant of Total Recall. Protected by a throng of Pegasi. I could probably take them with my main boy. Especially if I pump up by killing everyone else in this area first. That's a cartographer too. Could probably take them. I'd like to go over here and explore more of this map. More of this side. That I haven't really been to. Stop! Hop in there. Nice. All right, bud. Tomato is a boomer trapped. I played this game when I was a kid. I'm not a boomer trapped in a zoomer's body, all right? I played this when I was five. I didn't get it. I didn't understand it. Get these guys. Get them. I didn't get it. I was not good at it, but I did play it. Oh, my vampires are dying. They're killing my boys. These skeletons definitely need to get that upgrade, chat. Why did I just do that for? Them? Whatever. Both reach both sides, so it's fine. We only lost one vampire, actually, from that. Wait, we lost none. Never mind. God damn. Much to your dismay, the Cloud Temple is guarded by a few giants. Fight the guards? No. <laughs> no, but I am going to fight these guys and get the knowledge at the end of this tunnel. Fucking gods. Weak and pathetic, the gods. No losses. Oh, really? I can't reach it. Okay. Surely we can get you some troops now, Nagash, and you can start doing stuff too, yeah? Wait! I faked you out. I meant to say, uh, I meant to say Tamika. Sorry. That was rude. Gremlin populations double. You know who has gremlins? Me. I have 166 of- 44 of these little goblins in my house right now. Fort. City Hall, we need a marketplace still. All right, Gretchen, uh, where else can you go right now? You can go over there. Chat, if you see the artifact I need to become an unfortunate uh, circumstance of old school gaming and the inability to patch your game properly once it's out, uh, let me know. You know what I'm talking about if you've played this game before. Just hook me up and yell, there it is. Get that right now. And I will go get it right now. It's very important to me. But I get that right now if I see it. Uh, get him. We need we need troops so I can start getting wacky. So we're gonna fill up the team. We need more money. We need more. 
gonna go down. This never went this way. And then we can swing on over to there and try to get the eye. Actually, we shouldn't struggle to get the eye. Ever smoking ring of sulfur. One step at a time. Let's get the goblins first. How, how bad are crusaders, chat? Are those scary? You guys gotta like tell me if they're scary, because I don't know enough about the enemies in this game. To know who's scary and who isn't. Yes, Crusader's scary? Probably. That's what I'd guess, too. They're a bit spooky. Yeah, this isn't my super team. This is like B team, so I don't really want to get into any wacky fights with this crew yet. They're not that tough. Pathetic. But they will be soon. That's Tantown, huh? I don't have my good gear, though! Tamika! Bring the extra armies! Bring more! We're gonna camp outside their town, chat. This place is mine. Tan's gonna regret the day it lived here. Soon enough. Vial of lifeblood. I don't want that. We'll do the imp cache, though, which has already been looted by some goblin asshole. Goblins. We need to get this guy back to town. Vial of Life is the best skeleton item? Let me get it then. Which, who's guarding it? Lots of scorpi- scorpi cores? I don't know if I can take lots on this guy. I need to bring Tamika down with more, more with more, like, guys. I need, I need full power liches. I gotta wait another round. If I can get my power liches refilled, we should be okay. I can speed it up by dimension dooring up a little bit. Wait, we can actually see what's around us right now. Well, there's no one for miles, which is good. Uh... Necklace of Ocean Guidance. Throng of Grand Elves. Warrior's Tomb. That's worth going to. Well, I am going to let Tamika run down here. And I am going to just like kill some other guys in the area while I'm waiting. Yeah. I'm going to let her fill up on gear from this week. All the guys that we have available. I'm going to have her run down. Can have her give them to me, and then go back from when she came. Understand? Honestly, we're probably good, but I wouldn't mind getting the two ghost dragons first. Alright, go check out this area. Horde of stone gargoyles. I want to check out the cartographer. Finish then. Ooh, they go fast. Are those obsidians? Yeah. Let's not fight. Let's let the dragons deal with that. Yeah. My guy's boxed in. I made a mistake. Okay, we're good. Continue on as normal, gentlemen. Damn. My men. Maps cost 1,000 gold, which you don't seem to have. Please stop wasting my time. I'm gonna kill this guy later, chat. I'm gonna find a way to kill him. I'm getting- I'm getting there! Look, dude, you gotta give me some time. I've only just recently started finding cities to buy. Well, to steal. Need mage guild level one. Alright. Give me that map. Oh my god. Well, now I can see a little bit. Got a little bit more I can do. Kill these master gremlins. Kill them. It's not over resolve it. Kill them all. Yes. I almost have a thousand fucking skeletons, chat. We're getting there. People said I'd never do it. Actually, no one said I couldn't do it. I said I couldn't do it. My armies are getting ridiculous. 
Then again, this guy's not really gaining anything from it right now because I don't have an open slot for normal skeletons in my army. Which is a bummer. We're gonna have to find a fix for that. Oh wait, we are gay. Oh, I didn't. I didn't realize that's how it worked. Oh my god, we gotta get the to town right now, Aslan. Things have changed. Activate. Actually, you don't have any spells. Activate. Walk back to town. Wow. I would have been much more confident in my abilities if I had skeleton warriors this whole time. That's sort of embarrassing. Why didn't anyone... You guys were all probably, like, either not telling me because you respect the backseat rule, or you were telling me and I was ignoring you, which was making you even more angry. Either one's good by me, to be honest. Let's go get these guys. I don't know why I did the Wraith one. That was a bad play. Oh, we're okay. Yes. 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 More skeleton warriors. Okay, well, uh, stuff up here is pretty wacky right now. I can't squeeze anymore. Yo, uh, Gretchen, you suck. She sucks, dude. I don't even know why I have her. I'm not gonna use her. She's gonna hang out at town the whole time and like guard it as like an additional like backup if something goes wrong. All right, uh, buy the ghost dragons. I'm so poor. I'm so poor. I don't even need the ghost dragons. I don't need those. I just need, I want the dreadnoughts. I want a couple more of them. All right, let's go. Let's bring these down to our boy. I would love to see Tomato play Last Oasis. Here's the problem with Last Oasis. It's an early access survival game, which is the holy trinity of unholy horror. So I don't really want to touch that one if I can help it. I've got like a, I got a thing going on, I'm busy. All for the rest of the year. Advanced pathfinding reduces movement penalty for rough terrain by 50%. I'm sorry, uh, sorcery, but you know. Man, whoever lives in this town sort of sucks. Wait a minute. Man, the people in the town are completely defenseless. Hang on. <laughs> I don't even need you, Gretchen. You go, like, level up. Do something good with your life. Go explore. Do something. I don't need you. I just checked. The, I just checked. I was just, like, assuming they would have a finished town. I guess I shouldn't be operating on that assumption. Huh. Uh, City Hall? I don't think we can get capital. No, we can't. Okay, so this is as much money as we're going to be making a turn off of them. All right, Aslan. Hopefully we can level these guys up at this town or we got a long fucking way to get this guy back home again. Oh, I'm going to be seeing a lot more of the people moving in this game now. Because of this. Because of this map I got. What a trashy map, too, you know? What a bad map. I guess it's only showing hallways, not not cliffs. All right, please let me upgrade these here. Ah! Fine, fine, I'm cool, I'm cool. I just have to take a long walk all of the way back home. Not a big deal, no biggie, no biggie. I can handle that. Yeah, I can handle that. It's just fucking absurd distance to travel with no uh, dimensional door. Hey, at least maybe when we get back, we'll have dimensional door. Because I have expert wisdom, so getting back might be faster if I can find a skip. All right, bud. We should not struggle to capture this base. Now, these guys are fucking completely defenseless, turns out. <laughs> so we're just going to sort of, like... Fly in there, kill them, <laughs> eat them, like all. Everyone just fly over. I'm gonna send um, chain lightning, in to hit the trogs. <laughs> I was 
fucked up. That, that was fucked up. That was fucked. Thanks for the town. Man, it's completely unfinished. Actually, the city hall also isn't done. This place needs a marketplace and a blacksmith. What the fuck? All right. Move in. We live here now. Uh, buy yourself a... Buy a ballista while we're here. If we could afford one, but we're so, so poor. All right. Uh... Well, currently, we should send Tamika. Tamika, what's your you you your dread knight person, right? I'm gonna have Tamika pick up the dread horses from from our boy. All right, down here, she's gonna pick up all of them because she will eventually have a buff on that. And you, Gretchen? Oh my God, Gretchen! I don't know what to. Gretchen, you're gonna like work with. Gremlins. Which is gonna take a while because we need a lot more money to do that. And we're currently upgrading two towns at the same time, so it's gonna be a bit. But whenever we get money to spare to give to you, you will get gremlins, and you will live off of gremlins, and you will be friends with the gremlins, and you will frolic with the gremlins. Oh, that person's pretty close to our base. That person, they, they're mad. All right, those guys are mad, Chet. Whoever that is. Mother of God! Well, it's a good thing we've got two people here now. Hey, uh, trade troops with me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And thank you. All right, uh, Tamika, sorry about basically scamming you out of your adventure, but you should go. <laughs> you don't want to be here for this. This could get spicy. By the Citadel, right now. Yeah, this guy might come for us. He's got... Several bad things that I'm not happy to see in an army. That's Gunner. That's the bad boy. How close is this guy to the base? With the power... With the power of... Hang on, isn't there a gate I used to get over here? Wait a minute. Yes. How far of a trip is this? How much spell power do we have right now? 86? We're just gonna walk for this part. He's not gonna make it in time to help, unfortunately. We have chain lightning. We have a lot of spell power. We are in a base. We are the defensive right now. And we have a lot of guys. I'm not think, I don't think we're doomed. I don't think it's good, but I don't think we're doomed. All right, it could be a lot worse is what I'm trying to say. I'm not gonna buy anything this turn. Because they might take so long that I can actually buy some more recruits at this time. Yeah, we're going to have to wait it out. See what they do. Save? No, dude, I'm all in, man. I'm all in. This is Gunner. This is my arch nemesis. Ah! Yeah, he's got a big fucking army. Mother of God. He has no spell points, though, is the thing. And I have animate dead still. Okay, that's gonna help a lot at this point. Uh, well, we're not gonna go out there yet. I'm just gonna park my fucking dragon at the door. Oh, they flown it. They're flying in to hit my power liches. That's ideal. Let's uh, keep them from being able to do that again. Oh yeah, that's a gate there, huh? Okay, how much health do these guys have? A lot, but they should also be dead fairly quickly if we go after them. But I don't want to. They're going to go through the, the water, which is going to bother them. That's uncomfortable for them. Uh, I'm going to hold off for a minute. But what I am going to do is fly the wraiths over the wall on this side and get immediately clowned on by the one thing that could take a turn right after us. 
which I wasn't prepared for. We need to kill the Minotaurs. Okay, they're... Okay, the Wraiths are actually doing a good job being an excellent distraction, which is honestly more than I could have hoped for with them. They don't usually do much. <laughs> they're, they're a good distraction right now for me to get these Minotaurs out of the way because they're the thing that scares me, is the Minotaurs. Manticores are bad too, but the Minotaurs are spooky. They do a lot of damage. So do the Manticores. Those two are gonna be the problem. But if everyone's clubbed up on the Wraith, next turn I can do Chain Lightning again. Let's, uh... I went to the water with the vampires, but I, I, I wanted to get the kill on those guys before they get a turn. Skeletons, uh... Move here. Okay, this is actually... The vampires are doing pretty good. Still not ready to do my turn. Did that just open the gate for them up there? Possibly. Okay, well, here's what we're gonna do. Please bully them. Yeah, kill those guys. I don't really know why this became a situation where everyone's leaving the base. It wasn't exactly my intention when I did this, but uh, I think in this situation, I actually gained more by not casting this on these guys. Actually, no, I gained much more by casting it on them. Oh, it spread to my guys. I did not know that was how that worked. Oof. Oofta. Please don't take the water. Thank you. Yes! Big shit, boy! Alright, it's over. We win. Aside from those assholes in the back, that just fucking... That just changed the whole fucking game, dude. We just crit those guys double damage. Get the fuck out of here. All right, we gotta be careful still. It's not a win yet, but that was big. Just gotta get to those Medusas now. How's my how are my ghost dragons doing? They're holding it, but the beholders still have a lot of health. I didn't even see those fucking those bastards there. This is comedy of fucking up. But we, I think we're gonna be okay at the end of all this. Let's stop these guys from doing any more range shit. Medusas are stuck and they can't do anything. All right. And now, to really fuck these guys over. Hey, can you uh, res my uh, my two dragons back? One of my dragons, yeah, thanks. And one next turn, chat, I'm gonna res my skeletons back. <laughs> yeah. That's right! I do what I want! Who am I using? Who am I channeling through right now? Kill them. Come on, dude, have mercy. This is their strongest fucking soldier. It has to be. So once we kill these guys, Beige or Tan, whoever the fuck they are, are going to have some seriously fucked economies. They're going to be in a lot of trouble after this. They're probably going to re retreat soon. If I had to guess. Uh, man, these beholders still have a lot of health, huh? But they're almost dead. Glad they came into melee. Let's finish them off. They're doing most of the damage to the team. Am I ready? I am. Animate dead. Skeletons, all 83 of you that died, come back. <laughs> yes. Yes. They ran the cowards! Get the fuck out of here! Get out of my town! Fuck you, Gunner! Fuck you! That's right! Give me basic offense for my skeleton boys. Give me advanced offense for my- Ah, uh, but air magic's pretty good for haste. This is actually the first time I've been compelled to not take damage ups. I have, chat, look at my spell power though, dude. I literally barely ever have a shortage of it. I'm gonna, ah, I'll take basic for this one. Oh, did it just tell me where another fucking base was? I'm sorry, where's that at? Where's that at if we're getting, no, there's blue. There they are. I can't just get to them easily, I don't think. 
So this guy was going, what was I saying? I was sending this guy back so we could level up his town. Well, his, uh, his skeletons, because he has still an absurd amount of them. Yeah, I can't just walk to that, can I? Wait. Oh my god. Well, chat, we know what we're doing now. We are going to do a ridiculous amount. We're going to go finish off Tan when we're done with this, I think, is what we're going to do. All right, Tamika. I, uh... I feel bad that she's getting benched again so quickly, but, like, we sort of operate in the assumption I wouldn't need all... We did need all of those troops to win. Unfortunately. In a marketplace. Okay, so I wonder what the odds are I can beat a lot of Crusaders. Wait, where's that thing? I want Vial of Lifeblood. I wonder what the odds are that I can beat Scorpy Corpse in my current state. I'm gonna save. I don't know. I don't remember how strong Scorpy Corps are, but I do want that item. They're pretty strong. But I have 90 out of 90 spell points right now. So I can really fuck with these guys. Including cursing them. Which will cause them to inflict much less damage. What's their element? What do they do? Paralyzing Venom. Okay. I might just fuck with their morale once we get once we close in. Actually, I guess that would be right now. Reduce their chances of fighting back. Dragon Chan! Oh yeah, there we go. He had to skip a turn because we fucked with his morale. So that one's not going to be moving as much. Dude, here's the thing though. If they can't kill my two dragons, I'll get one back in a second. How many more do I have? They have 11 still. God, they have troops but people are saying this item's really good for me so I don't really want to fucking I don't want to just give up and not get it fall back let him go after the skeletons that's our job they kill 40 a pop these guys all right let's um let's hit them with the morale debuff too Nice. We just gotta get through, we gotta get their, their stacks down. We got this. Yeah, we got this. We got it. They're about, the, this is a stack of four. This is a stack of four as well. We got it. Yeah, we got it. Use animate on dragons. Don't at me with what to do, please. <laughs> I, uh, I'm okay. Thank you. I know I can animate my dragons, chat. You wanna know how I know I can animate my dragons? Cause I did it in the fucking siege, chat! Literally, I did it in the siege! Fucking Neanderthals. Genuinely. I don't even want, now I don't even want it. Now I don't even want it because then you're gonna be like, I fucking made him do it. I, I did it. I backseated successfully. But like, I was gonna do it right now, the whole time. Anyways. <laughs> that was always what was gonna happen. I already, like I said I was gonna do it. In this fight, I said I was gonna do it. Okay, they're just going after my power lich. All right, that went well for me. The vial of lifeblood increases the health of all your units by two. That's, uh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good, yeah. All right. Let me, uh... God, I wish I had another necropolis town, dude. Instead of this trash. Well, I'm gonna keep exploring to the south for now on this guy. Here's the thing. In order to, you know, it's actually worth it with this guy right now to toss all these skeletons I have currently in here. Because if I have them, I think I'm getting resurrected. 
I think I'm resurrecting normal skeletons instead of armored ones, correct? Or is it do, is it going to the armored? I'm not sure which one I need. Like if I have these in here, is it making them normal skeletons? I think I need I think I need the armored ones and to leave these ones in the base for now. Because I don't want to be resing them. Okay. Uh time to start leveling up the mage guild again. But first let's get the four. You need your slots full to resurrect armored skeletons? Oh. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. Well, let's get back to uh, the house. I think it's this one. Yeah. Okay. And while that's happening, we're gonna swing this guy down. We're just gonna leave those skeletons there. I'm not turning all the way back around for them. All right. Tamika, let's get you some ding-dang levels. Uh, yeah? First of all, though, let's, uh... Let's throw you in the skeleton transform. Honestly, you're just taking up a slot right now. Beep. Yes. 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 Okay, so while these I do actually I'm coming around to the zombies too and they're in high stack numbers. They're pretty good. I'm coming around to them. Power liches, yes. Dread knights we need to wait for. Get anything here? Need five thousand dollars, and we can get the next tier of like income. Look at them scampering around, stealing my treasure. I just have to watch as they do it. Look at them. They must think they're so fucking good. Well, we'll show them the power. Of my magic. Let's get landmines here first, though, because obviously we're somewhat close to um, the enemy, considering they're they just showed up like instantly after we took that base. That's a dead body. You come upon the remains of an unfortunate adventurer searching through the scattered bones. You find nothing. Okay. A throng of gremlins. That's my thing. Kill them and make them into my Skella boys. I forgot to move my guy. I've got to move Aislinn. Oh man. I always forget to move my guys. Get these guys. Oh, yeah, the fucking. God, the fucking battle liches, dude. I need that super battle lich thing. I might also swing Aislinn over here and give him the uh, health bonus. Actually, I'm not sure. Because this guy is technically better. Honestly, I might just give all my guys to th to Thant. Because he is the better warrior. He is technically stronger. I might give him all the skeletons. Not the rest of my guys, just the skeletons. Eh, let's go back to the base first. Level up. Or else it's sort of meaningless. All right. Time to start getting some ridiculous shit from uh, from the uh, from these zones. So let's start buying some of the fucking. Actually, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Actually, not yet. Not yet. No, 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 no. First, we want to get some security. Here. Considering how close those guys were. It's two arrow towers, fortifies your town's defenses, and doubles base creature growth. Not yet on that. Uh, we're gonna get... We are gonna... 
start investing in the mage tower for this place. Because that place should get us another really good spell later on. Can I take a throng of battle dwarves? The answer is yes, most likely. Uh, via bullying them from a range. Matter of fact, let's bully them even more. See? 40% magic resistance, son of a bitch. All right, Dick. All right, fine. This guy's got an awful lot of health, actually. This could, uh, this could be bad. They, these guys are, like, angry at me. Check. I mean, they do very little damage, actually. Wait a minute. And I have res still, and 49 magic points. Hang on. No, I'm not that scared of them. But I am going to need to stop these guys now before they get to my... Yeah, I'm not that scared of them. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. They're dead, they're dead. They're fucked. Yeah, they're, they're, they're fucking doomed. They're doomed. They're completely boned. Yep, they're, they're, they're dead. They're done, so chat. These guys are done. They, they, it was scary for a second, but they're, they're done. And once the dragon gets hit again, I'm just gonna res him anyways. Yeah, we're gonna... These guys are pretty much done, so... Get rid of these ones. Okay, uh... Rian, animate now. I think on this guy. Yeah, there we go. Yes! Pathetic dwarves! We only lost four skeleton warriors at the end of all that. And we gained... Wow, that uh, we are very good at pathfinding. We gained 68, so, uh... Pretty good. Another horde of hobgoblins. Kill them. Yeah, dude, throngs, man. Just go after throngs. How's Gretchen doing? Just hanging out, looks like, at the house. Doesn't really do anything. There's nowhere for her to go in here. Like, everything's locked off. I need her to basically... We do need to just buy upgrade stations so she can get some guys here. Because all I can really buy for her is an absurd amount of gremlins. And like... Dude. No one wants gremlins. Not even I want gremlins. No one wants the gremlins. I don't really want to get those for her. But, I will buy a couple of these boys and go bully some normal entry-grade enemies. Here, I see a bunch of hobgoblins we can get down here for you, Tamika. I like the gremlins. I want gremlins, says chat. No, you fucking don't. Why lie? You know, that's the thing I don't get. Next, you're going to say you like Nagash, and no one likes him. He sucks. I just got Earthquake. Wait, really? Are, are you sure I should be getting that? Alright. Pretty sure that's a pretty good one. I think that's a good one. Where is it? Randomly damages two sections of castle wall in combat. That's pretty good for raiding. Another throng of gremlins. More skeletons for my skeletal army that I'll have to upgrade because I don't have a full slot count right now, unfortunately. I'll have to walk this guy all the way back. Soon. At least now I know how it works. What's this? Dwarven treasury. I don't know about this one, chat. I don't know about a dwarven treasury. What I do know about is getting about a thousand upgraded skeletons in one more turn. That's what I know. All right. That one, I'm into. We need to start getting upgrade. We need to start getting like the unlockable stations for these places so that we can get uh, actual like guys that we can spawn. So we gotta start getting all the enemy spawners for this place. All right. Tamika. You can take a horde of gremlins. It should be nothing. Yes. 
Look at them go. Look at their power. Nice. 18 skeletons. More. Wait, they decide, they ask to join me because I'm so, oh wait, they were lost. They might've been lost. Well, in that case, swap with these skeletons. Thank you. Now I can get armored ones. Even better. Even better. Just, I didn't want those gremlins, chat. Remember that, I did not want the gremlins. They asked to join. I didn't seek them out. I did, because I didn't want them. All right, let's see what the damage is on this. Uh, first of all, I'm gonna need to fill a slot here so I don't have to deal with, oh yeah, oh my God, Chet. We can do all of it. Ghost dragons upgraded. Might as well get more before we go. We're gonna be here for a little bit because this guy's about to become an ascended god. Also, can he do dimension door now? Oh, he can do dimension door. You gotta be kidding me if you think he can't do fucking dimension door. Of course he can do fucking dimension door. What is this? Get the altar of earth here. You find a dwarven treasury. Do you wish to attack the guards? Not exactly, honestly. Not really. Not really. No, I do not want to dismiss the fucking hero. Water wheel. Where are guys I can bully? That's not guys I can bully. Those are guys that are gonna bully me. It doesn't go down there. I haven't explored down south, and Tamika has nothing else to do and needs XP, so. Down she goes. Look at them! That's my treasure! That's all mine! I have the map for it, dude. I can't let him get away with it anymore. I need more dragons. Nine dragons. More dreadnoughts. I'm gonna have to wait for the week to roll over because I have to buy one group of like some other weird class. I'll probably buy like one normal dragon so that I can uh, fill all of my slots with something that I can replenish easily. Because uh, I want to make sure that I can actually get armored skeletons all the time. Zombies? I mean, a dragon would be more effective. Just in case I do need to use it for something. Buying like two normal dragons would mean that I have a like, safety net. So that'll be in another week. Well, another turn. More attack skill. More attack skill if we get down to there. More hobgobs. I'm telling you guys, they make the oof. They make the Roblox oof. They do the sound. I don't know what to tell you, dude. They're making the fucking sound. Yes. I don't know if I'm just hearing it because I'm going crazy, but I definitely hear them making going, oof, like the sound. I hear the sound. All right, we're starting to get all sorts of elementals. And how close are we to getting anything decent here? Mage Tower. Okay, perfect. Now we can start getting magic. Oh, one more week. Then he can get on with... Then we're going all the way to Tan in the basement. We're going, we're going to bring this guy all the way down there. We'll kill anyone in our way. That was Gunner. I know that was fucking Gunner. He's alive. He's alive. Chad, I know it. Power liches, activate. Special vampires, activate. And now, how expensive is this? Hang on, did I use all my money? Chat. This is a very expensive purchase, leveling up this many skeletons. That might be like in the 10Ks. That might be a lot. That might take a minute for us to get that. I don't think I can just squeeze in that way. Well, yeah, that might take a minute. I don't think I was anticipating that. Is that prison? I can't just get to that. Okay, well, I'm gonna save my money then, because I do want all those skeletons leveled now. God, that's gonna be so dumb, chat, how strong this is gonna get. 
they're gonna be able to, with haste on, they're gonna be able to clear the whole map and like actually murder anything in the whole fucking game. Oh, it's gonna be fucked. All right. 8K. There we go. They're down. I would like to buy one special dragon. Two special dragons. Two of the normals. There we go. Now, we've got two, we've got a full team, so no one's gonna be getting, oh yeah, check. Give me a look, give me a couple more while I'm here. Now then, shall we? What difficulty is this on? Normal. Wait a minute, which way was it to the way I wanted to go? Oh, it was this way. It was up here. Oops. Wait. No, we're fine. It was here. That's not a huge detour. We're fine. We didn't make it yet. Uh, lots of champions. I can't take champions. But I can take another throng of battle dwarves, probably. Not without probably considerable losses, but... What, do you want to live forever? Or do you want to fucking be a champ? And look really cool all the time. I don't have enough money to afford college. No. I'm gonna keep going south. Because we've never explored that area. How big is the map? It's not huge. We've already cleared out most of it. Most of it is... I mean, from what I've seen, chat, we've got a situation. It's that uh, tan is nothing anymore. And green and blue are at about my level, it looks like. Or incredibly stronger than me, and it's not even gonna be a fight at the end of the day. They're gonna wipe me out so easily. Which could be bad. They might just totally destroy me. A horde of liches or a throng of battle dwarves. I don't think I wanna do either, actually. I think what we do. I mean, there's not much else to do, though. What, am I gonna fucking live like a coward for the rest of my life, or am I gonna fucking do something? Go for it. Oh! Oh, I thought there would be, like, multiple, like, stacks of it. But instead, it's just one you. All right, well, uh, in that case, forget- Oh, I can't even give him forgetfulness. God dang it, undead boys. In that case... What? Okay, in that case... In that case, uh, teleport my weak ass skeletons on top of them. All right, get them, boys. Get them, boys. Go on now. Get to work. Yeah, let's see how your ranged abilities work. Um, oh, it's just all. Oh, they actually do almost more damage in melee. Technically less. Statistically speaking, less. Yes. Yeah, they're done, though. <laughs> Teleporting a bunch of skeletons onto them sort of did the trick. Yeah. Uh, alright. Reanimate this one now. Because I don't think we're going to lose another one. Yeah, okay. Basic offense or basic earth magic? Advanced offense. Boost my damage more. Who'd be just free? Adela. A level 10 cleric. Okay. With adva with expert diplomacy. Huh. Expert diplomacy allows you to negotiate with monsters who are weaker than your group and reduces the cost of surrendering by 60%. That's pretty good. I'd prefer that on one of my necromancers, so I don't need to transfer stuff, but let's have her run up to, uh... Actually, probably the smarter option would be to exchange troops with Thant. But she's... I wouldn't want her to have undeads, so I think we actually... I think we take her up here and we give her a bunch of the elementals from this place that are currently, like, cooking up. Is what we do. Horde of sprites, we can take them. Aw, oh, man. I should have had Adela talk to these guys. Yeah, whatever. Kill them. That was a big mistake, what you just pulled with my dragon. Perish. Goodbye. Another war machine factory in the camp. Why hasn't Tomato been destroyed already? I'm very lucky for some reason today. And everyone just gets fucked by me. 
I've been pretty good. Ultra Thought. That's another different type of troop I can get now. And let's also get the uh, Golden Pavilion here. We want to start building up uh, garrisons and like numbers of guys that we can buy in emergency situations. So, all right, Tamika. Wait, what's that up there? A throng of gnolls. We can take that, or can we? Because they didn't—they didn't seem very scared of us. We—we we can't take them, right? Tamika, you're not gonna. Tamika, we can take them, right? You're not gonna. I'm not gonna magically lose to these guys, are we? I don't want to lose any slots, so I gotta be careful. Ah, uh, use um, curse that guy. Yeah, now send the zombies up. They are the most expendable. After the hobgoblin. Get into position, everyone. I don't think he's gonna be able to reach us in one. Do 10 damage a pop. Okay, yeah, we're good for one more round. Let's get the, let's box them. All right, we could use, we could lose some zombies. They're not that bad. Uh, over here. Nice. And he cursed him again. Good. All right, vampires. Everyone like surround him. Yeah, it's over. We're done, so we can spend our. Uh, as long as they don't lose any actual num like slots, we won't have to worry about getting normal skeletons. So yeah, that's. Oh man, I don't even want. I just want advanced offense, dude. That's 24 skeleton warriors on them. On right there, baby. Okay. We should be able to wipe out 10 if they're only in the basement when we get there. But it's, it is a long fucking trip. Okay, so you know how to get here, yes? He does. It's convoluted as shit, but he knows how to get there. Maybe we kill some guys on the way, increase the uh, number of our troops while we're doing it. Let's get a pyre. All right, we've got the end game. Uh, we got firebirds now, um, so yeah. This girl's gonna be able to get a pretty decent army going at our at our new city. I think. A little bit low on money, but you know. I would like to get that stuff. So let's do that now. I'm so poor! Uh, give me that then. One more turn, then I'm gonna buy it. I'm gonna buy a ballista on this guy. I'm so poor all the time. And I have multiple towns too. I earn like fucking 8,000 gold a turn. Like actually I earn 8,000 gold a turn. And I can't afford this stuff. Give me the ballista. All right. Cape of velocity. I don't know, dude. I don't know if I can take lots of champions. sort of been I've sort of been losing troops I think I go back to town on this guy like main town I get uh, I get armored skeletons set up on this guy too before I go fighting any other stupid fights throwing them evil eyes kill him look at them awed by my power run that's right run get him In hindsight, probably taking this fight wasn't a great idea. On account of the fact that these guys do a decent amount of damage. But I don't want to be a pansy. As long as I don't lose any stacks, I don't really care that much. Yes. Yes, get them. Get all of them. gonna let the skeleton over here get this one. God damn, yeah, they're all dead. They're all pretty much done. Yeah. They're only killing skeleton warriors, which is... Ooh! Ah, we lost 59. Hero, hero's movement over land by 10%, or we'll do earth magic. Got 36 back. 
This is a temple, which does... I absolutely have no idea what that does. No one's been here before. We, we have time to do some fucking exploration, check some stuff out, Jam. Yeah, we have time to fuck around, kill some liches before we go and wipe out Tan. I mean, I haven't seen anyone from Tan in eons. I'm not even sure they're still playing. They might have died on their own somewhere, embarrassingly. Ow! Get those guys. You can say tan is even a color. Yeah, I know, that's what I'm thinking, dude. We haven't seen him in ages. Ever since I kicked Gunner's ass. Part of Centaurs. This is like a freebie of like 80,000 guys to fucking kill for me. Come here. Add them to the pile. Let's <sighs> auto resolve them. This is like a thousand free fucking units. Yes! More! More! Their bones added to the armies! More! More. 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 Alright, uh, I'd like to get the Cloud Temple, which means I need the Altar of Wishes. All right, we're getting there, we're getting there. Okay. Let's go down here. And you. It's a long fucking way back home with how slow these people are. God damn, dude. I didn't realize how strong I was becoming, how powerful. Okay. Help, help me. Who is that? Ah. Uh... I'm in a bit of danger, is what I would say if I didn't have an, uh, interdimensional uh, portals. Where are those guys? Oh. Dude. Bro. Get the fuck over here. Come here. I wonder how, if I could... Wow, dude. It's not even that crazy. It's not even... It's like 20 a pop. I could just cut in line and kill this person real quick. <laughs> it's not even that wild. Come here! Why are you running? Get back here right now! Damn it, she's just too quick. She's gonna capture my fucking crystal mine! And also, she revealed that somewhere down south is a blue town. Which was a big mistake. Probably shouldn't have done that. Mine. Oh wait, I didn't confirm that. Oh, oops. You press the X button, it actually redoes the fight. I win. A horde of magma elementals is not worth that section. But I will kill all of the others. I want to see. I haven't checked how much damage they, they do numbers-wise, chat. Earth magic. There's all so much stuff I'm just getting. Okay, so we haven't gone south before. We're sitting on a good amount of guys, so um, we're gonna just kill everything we see for a while, while being extra careful not to lose any men, if we can help it. Did you hear that? And Roblox fucking oof. That is so fucking absurd how strong the power liches are. They have AoE. So all their attacks hit in a like actual hex shape. Which makes them fucking stupid if you get people to stack on them. They're coming near my hobs. Protect me. Yes. Cyclops stockpile. We don't fuck with that. We do fuck with a horde of zombies though. 40 points of damage? Uh, haste? 
Why'd the music stop? Hello? Game audio? Oh, okay, it's fine now. I don't know, I hasted someone by accident that I didn't even mean to because I was so spooked by the fact that game went completely quiet. It, like, scared me. Guess I'll get an extra turn now. Yeah, we should be A-OK, -okay, fine, chat. Unless they kill my fucking knight, at which point I'll be pretty bummed. Surely not, though. Okay, yeah, we're fine. Yeah! We're good, we're good. Dang, man. Even now, they do a pretty good amount of damage to these guys. Look at this hop job. He just hangs out with his friend, the Lich, in the back line, because I don't know what to do. He's so weak, but, like, I need him so I can get the right skeletons. I'm worried that we've lost a decent amount of units in this fight. Yeah, we just lost some normals, actually. And there's Expert Necromancy, baby! There it is! Legs of the Legion. We already have this, but we're gonna get it again. Also, let's upgrade the Pyre, which is gonna let us get actual Phoenixes, which are fucking stupid. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna start hoarding those with our new girl. Yes. And while that's happening, down in the depths with Gretchen, we're gonna be getting fucking giants! Chat, we've got three fucking cities that are all uh, end game enemies, for the most part. There's a chance this could all end very soon. Give me that. Give me that. Kill these, gu kill these guys. I gotta be thorough, cause what if I miss like the super item that I need to like win the whole game, you know? Like if I don't, if I like skip a zone. Is it, wow, those dragons though. Like, what if I miss like the super item? Okay, this guy's gonna fucking die now. Hey. Now I know what you're thinking. I know that you're mashing the retreat button really quickly so that you can respawn uh, back at your base. No, 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 Dead. Fuck off. Die forever. Yes. Okay. Get the fuck out of my world. Okay. So we're gonna run her up and she's gonna buy a bunch of stuff at this base. We may also have uh, Thant buy one so that he's not sitting on normal. Actually, we're going to run him all the way back to town for him specifically. And uh, where are you at? Legs of the Legion, which is increased growth for of uh, second level units in that town. Not very helpful to me right now. I don't think I can take a horde of sharpshooters because I'm not very familiar with... Whoa. Armor of Wonder. Protected by a horde of gogs and a horde of hobgoblins. Get them. These gogs are awfully fucking confident. They weren't even like scared of me at all. They just decided to start the fight. Oh. Maybe I should be scared of that. We need to close the gap on them. Just gotta get to them. Everyone run, even you hop, friend. Get to them! Yeah, there we go. Not so tough once people reach you, huh? Yeah, not so tough anymore, Gog! Why would he go into melee range? I guess... I guess instead of wasting a turn? I left for 15 minutes. What did I miss? My ascension to godhood, essentially, at this point. It's gonna be pretty hard with some of my guys for, uh... The, A the AI to really beat me anymore. I'm starting to reach the curve where necromancy gets actually fucking dumb. And I can just sort of stomp pretty much anything I see other than it's super endgame. Expert offense. Yes. What is this? Worn on the torso, the armor of wonder increases all four primary skills by one. Yeah, I'll take that. 
Yeah, I will take that. I will help myself to that. Uh, I think we want to get ourselves upgraded everything else that we can get, basically, you know? Upgrade every single fucking... I'd still need more stuff for this, though. I'd have to, I'd have to transfer some resources to get upgraded Cloud Temple. But we're not buying any giants yet, so we can actually hold off on doing that. Well, let's upgrade the Golden Pavilion. Yeah, we're gonna have a very large amount of fucking guys at the end of all this chat. And then Gretchen is also going to have a super army. It's just a matter of time. Who the hell's that? Who's that? Blue's fighting greens, I think. I don't think that's near my base. No, he's not near my stuff. That's some other guy. Hop, gobs. Shell him. Good. Uh, hold off. Let the skeletons fight him. Yes. Ring of vitality. Increases the health of all your units by one. Yes! More power! More health! What is this shield I just got? Increases the de your defense skill by four! Even better! A horde of pit fiends. What are you guarding back there, friend? Oh, man, this is the one that might fuck me. Pit fiends aren't scared of me. And they have a lot of health, but he looks like he's guarding a lot of shit behind him. I'm not about to run. Let's see how you like this one, bud. <laughs> yes, it's time to finally test our true power. Chat. Collapse on him. Okay, so they can kill one dragon at a time. Pretty sure Pit's Fiends can also summon people. Has it used Meteor Shower yet? No, because it hasn't really been necessary yet. how much damage they do. Oh! 32 and 1! Don't finish the turn yet. We're not done here. Oh, I don't have heal on... I don't have animate on this guy. Damn, I would have res some of my skeletons or, like, the dragons that I lost in this. Holy shit! We lost four dragons and only 78 armored guys. Well, it was worth it to get in here, I think. Fucking mother of God. Okay. Just keep upgrading our, all of our other trash and we are here. Okay, so we're gonna start hooking her up with a good army. As soon as uh, we have some money. All right, bud, what am I going to do with you? He's also not really... Oh, yeah, I wanted to send him back home so he could get his, uh, his skeleton army stuff set up. I didn't want to ditch all my other ones. Oh, actually, while I'm here. Remind me, I don't want to leave just yet. I, want, I don't want to leave just yet. There's something I got to do. Okay, you dip out. You... Going. Grab these boys. Okay. All right. So what is there still for me to do here? Guess I can go that way. How do I visit the Dragon Utopia? Oh, there we go. You stand before the Dragon Utopia, a place off-limits to mere humans. Do you wish to violate this rule and challenge the dragons to a fight? No. No, thank you. No, thanks. I'm, I'm busy. I got stuff going on. I might be busy until the end of time, so don't bother calling me later to ask either. Look at all these blue boys we can buy. Can hire them all, dude. It's only 8,000 bucks. 
I'm telling you, dude. What this is the this is the this is the curve right now, is that in order for someone to fight us, we're gonna have so much money that we can just instantly buy an army anywhere at a certain point, because we're just not really spending it. I'd like to investigate this Forsaken Palace. Group. You devils! No, I changed my mind. I don't want to do that either. Okay, so. If we get this person nice and kitted out, they will be so scary that their diplomacy will kick in instead. I don't want to buy that one yet. I want the upgraded... Oh, we need a mad... We, okay, so we need this. We want everything at max level from them that we're buying now as the leak rolls over. So this person can just start fucking, like, scaring people into surrendering. It's gonna take a little bit for their army to get big enough to do that, though. More gremlins. More gremlins. <laughs> Yes. We just need more. We just need the pie. Oh, actually, okay, we're fine. Expert earth magic. Take it. Uh, money. The gogs are awed by my power. As they should be. Get them. Oh, yeah, and you? Chad, this is the new BM, huh? Cause I sort of feel like doing this every time. <laughs> Cause that's fucked. And we have so many spell points. That's so fucked. That that's like the most fucked up thing I can do. Basically instantly teleport my nuke to them. Like the what they can't do anything about it. We do fucking hang on, go back up. We do 2,000 damage. These guys only have 13 health a pop. It's happening. My power. Yeah, I think it's about time to make our chat like legit. We go to a fucking siege, we teleport that bomb into the base, and we just tactically nuke their strongest enemy in one move. It's only gonna get better, chat. It's only gonna get better. Hang on, I gotta check something. Give me one second. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I don't want to get distracted. I want to send that other guy to destroy that town now, for sure. No. So we should, um... What do I still need for this? Why can't I build it? Three... Three, 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 three thousand. Oh, I already built here. That's why. Okay. Turn has it built. Okay. Uh, you go over here. Horde of the Walking Dead. We can take that. You should be able to take that. Okay. I think we're gonna be able to, once we get this guy, once we get this boy ready. All right. Oh my God, lots of enchanters. The enchanters awed by your power are scared. Let them go. I don't really wanna fight them. I'm not gonna fight lots anymore because I already have like basically max XP. I don't really wanna fight lots of guys. I wanna fight throngs and hordes. Let the others go so I can save like health. Uh, how many was this? It's Walking Dead, though. That's a waste of my time. No marauders! Hit him with a... Nothing. Actually, yeah, do nothing. Sh shell him. We should be okay. This should... These are just gnolls. I shouldn't struggle to kill them. Sort of worried about my slots, though. Yeah, we're, we're fine. These guys are nothing. I just realized this person... Oh, she does have haste. Okay. Uh, in that case, he's haste skeleton. All right. Ah, uh, Nolchan down here is getting pretty fucking close. Uh, 
just gonna quickly box in my power liches. All right, no, no, we're fine. We got this under control. Is it over? The nightmare, it's over. More. Unicorn Glade. I don't really want to fight that, honestly. I don't think. Yeah, nah. Okay, I would like to get this. That's magic elementals, psychic elementals. Give me these. And now give me all of the magma boys. And I still need to get the upgraded fire elemental thing. So let's hold off on that for a minute. Uh, all right. We're ready. Next turn. Why is no one capturing that beige tower? Is that not actually like a fucking place? Is that like someone's garbage house? I'm gonna be upset if it's someone's garbage house, dude. I'm gonna take, I actually, you know, I might take this. How many gremlins was this? A horde? Kill him. I might take that tunnel, see where it takes me. It might get me closer. God, uh, like almost a thousand, chat. I'll be happy in this stream having made it to a thousand fucking skeletons on the screen. I'll be happy with that. I might have to kill these serpent flies though. To get in there. Well, let's do this quick. God, there's so many too over here. 300 on this one. We can also teleport with these guys. And we're gonna do the same thing as last time. So we're gonna get two of these normal dragons since they're really resilient. Do it like that. And now we're just gonna head out with this group. Once we uh, get some more power liches. All right. Uh, throng of lizardmen. Hmm. I don't think I can do anything here yet. Dividing power liches might be good. No! I like big stacks of things. Wow, these are bold. I mean, I know there's a lot of them, but like, you know. We'll see how that works out for him in a second. Now I'm just, cu I'm curious to test my, my power, you know. Ow. I really killed 81 of them in one hit. They killed 54 of us. So I think it's, I think it's my win. Yeah, we, we got this. Okay. But we gained 41, so that was a nothing loss. Oh. Okay, that's really close to, uh... Wait a minute. Doesn't that put us pretty close to, um... To where a lot of blue guys have been coming out? Now, where are we? We're right here. A throng of fire! <sighs> Let them scatter. Actually, no. Kill them. Kill him! They're not that scary. I mean, they're sort of scary, but I'm, I'm gonna kill him. Okay, they're actually pretty scary. Okay, no, we, I mean, we still win. But they were able to kill quite a few of my guys. How'd you get skeleton from fire boys? I don't know. I'm, I'm not really sure, dude. All right. Oh shit. Wow, we gained the. We didn't really lose all that much, dude. We're back up top where we where we belong again. I just want, f dude. I want to just find. The, like any of the fucking guys, like any of the fucking guys, and just kill them. But like, I can't believe I've been struggling so much to like find anyone. This map was—I mean, this map's too big. 
made the map too big, I think. Because I, I can't believe I've found... I literally haven't found a faction base. Like, I don't actually think that city I'm looking at is a faction base, Chet. I think we're that fucked. Either way, I've been going for four and a half hours, and I've already mentioned tomorrow's Xanima update day, so I'm probably going to wrap it up. We're going to wrap it, because uh, this could go on for literally eons. But, yeah. Palm, good shit. It's a lot of fun. I love this game. But Xanima is going to be a long stream tomorrow, uh, which is going to take a fucking... I'm going to be running that whole game all the way back through with the new update that just came out today. So um, that'll be good. There's a bunch of new zones and a lot of new weapons and shit. Should be a good fucking time. Um, I'm not going to do the longing today because I actually want to wrap this up really quickly. So uh, I am just... We're, we're going to just slam it through this one today, okay? I'm, I'm going to get through the notifications pretty quickly today. Because like, I, I just partially also remember I sort of have to do something. <laughs> It's sort of a sort of a family member's birthday today, and it's currently just late enough that I'm supposed to be upstairs. So uh, I'm gonna wrap it up pretty quick today. Yes. So um, let me find where I was. Turn on the music again. Ooh. Uh, where was I? Last time. I'm totally fucking lost. The Kaji Kid, thanks for the five months prime. Fancy Banana, thanks for the three months prime. Wait, have I been here? I have not been here. Uh, Muli Mildjine, thank you for the sub. Big Bad Zombie 24, thanks for the prime as well. Eye of Valor, thanks for the 14 months. Big Oof, well, sounds like a good stream tomorrow as well, at least. Yeah, tomorrow will be great. I already refreshed my skills in that game, so I'm, I'm back at top form. I did a bunch of uh, tournament yesterday. I did a bunch of arena stuff to practice. Uh, Wacky Bear, thanks for the five months. Happy to see you play this. Be nice to see you have the, you have the gang play around. I don't really know if this is a very good multiplayer game to me. Actually, I guess it would be. It's just like, it's so exploitable. Like you'd have to ban Necropolis. You'd have to ban Necropolis. You'd literally have to ban it to make it work. F to play it properly. Petra 480, thanks for the 16 months. Lotus Maker, thanks for the two months prime. Croc Bane, thanks for the 13 months. Picklore, six months, nine months prime. Sleepy Bear, 1127, two months prime. Thank you. You've probably been asked a dozen times or more, but are you thinking about playing Monster Rancher again? Maybe. Super Nice Nick, thanks for the five gifted subscriptions to the channel. Thanks, Nick. Thank you very much. Young Pepe Fresh 420 Aqua, thanks for the six months. Thanks for all the great content. Hope you're feeling okay. Oh, high five. Oh. I'm feeling okay. I mean, like, fortunately, chat. Well, I mean, I went to the doctor on Monday um, to see about the shit I've been dealing with that isn't related to the cold I currently am dealing with as well. Um, and now I'm having a bunch of blood work done again. <laughs> Basically, I am being tested for everything that could possibly be a fucking problem at this point, which is both weird disturbing and also a little bit comforting because we're basically testing every fucking thing that I could possibly fucking have now because the doctor was just like I don't fucking know what's going on man <laughs> which is not what you want to hear from your doctor him basically going oh yeah I see problems here you got like you got like weird shit going on I can see that just looking at you and like you got symptoms, but I don't know what it is. And at least in your last round of blood work, nothing explains what you're dealing with. So they're just running me for another round before I can do anything else. Just looking at you. Yeah. I don't know if it's boomer stuff or what, but it, it's not fun. And I got to get to the bottom of it because it's just like, you don't want to be fucking sitting around trying to like live your life and just constantly getting pain that you don't understand. And like, you know, just sitting there and being like, ha, ah, this must not be a problem. <laughs> it's probably nothing. It's just really stressful. It's not fun. So that's why I'm, you know. But wait, that's not normal? No. <laughs> no. Leviathan7600, thanks for the six months. Giant Dragon Dongs, thanks for the eight months prime. Grizzly Man, 
Bear, thank you for the four months. Thank you. Bugs, thanks for the six months. Tristan, thanks for the three months. Castellian, ten months. God, I love this game. Thanks for playing and enjoying it too. Hey, thanks for fucking watching. C Niffer, thanks for the ten months. PK Manta, six months. Reamus, thanks for the four months. Dragons, one, two, three, six, nine. Thanks for the six months prime. Morph Max, thanks for the six. Rainbow Tan, 15 months. Real Wrath 101, eight months prime. Love your content, been watching since the YouTube era, man. Be safe in these dark days ahead. Yes. Once again, by the way, uh, the stable build for Cataclysm is out, which means if you want to get on all the most ridiculous content being added, holy shit. Uh, this is going to get fucked. Next couple weeks of Cataclysm are going to get fucked up, Jack. We're going to be adding a lot of new stuff now because of that. Anything that's been getting held up for the last, like, three months, it's going to be gonna be weird uh florence is thanks for the 15 months lonely stag thanks for gifting us up the man with bad eyesight thanks for the seven months prime rook the thick thanks for the two months prime chasing booty 11 months scooby dude 14 months prime burke reynolds thanks for the 10 months x gibbons thanks for the three months selnak 15 months prime sexy dexy thanks for the eight months and splork six months prime thank you so glad streamer played video game on my birthday. Hey, happy birthday, man. Happy fucking birthday, bro. All right, chat. I'm fucking out of here. I'm gonna send you... I'm gonna send you over to my boy. Octopip today. He's playing some Super Mario 64 mod thing. I'm gonna rate him. Going out with Octopimp chat. I will see you. Not no longing. Uh, not today. Uh, I was gonna. I was going to, but then I ran late. Tonight was gonna be a short stream either way. So um. Yeah. No, I did. I don't have time. I gotta go. So I will catch you guys tomorrow for a long Exanima excursion with the new update. That's what we're doing. So Exanima. Three to four p.m. All right. This should be a good time. Lots of new content, so that'll be that'll be fun. See you then. Bye bye.